But um bum there we go. Hello everybody. All right. Welcome Car Mechanic Simulator 2018. So, we're going to restore this uh, old Ford pickup truck. Yeah, it's kind of sporadic. I just magically wanted to do this. So, welcome aboard. This is a, a very classic Ford pickup, I believe a Ford F100. So this is uh, the best, one of the most legendary pickup trucks of all time. Hello to everyone in chat. Good to see you here today. If you haven't already, go ahead and uh, hit that subscribe button. Your name will pop up. Welcome aboard in the garage, folks. We got a lot of work to do here on this one today. In fact, we got a lot of missing parts, actually. There's some fender, like the whole back end is missing, and, uh, well, most of it anyway, the tailgate, fenders, and uh, more than likely going to have to uh, redo this thing inside and out. So hello, everyone. Welcome aboard. Good to have you all here. Thanks for hitting that like button. For those of you who are new to the show, hit that subscribe button. Your name will pop up here, as I had mentioned. And welcome to all the people flooding in here. Good to have you all here. Welcome, everybody. So I'm uh, doing a little testing here today. I thought I'd stream a little bit later to see how many people tuned in and uh, just trying to move some things around. I don't know what we'll. Sp I don't know what we will stream next. I don't know when we will stream next. So it's all magical. As long as you guys are subscribed, though, that's when you know we'll go streaming again. All right, welcome aboard there, Honda Rider. Thanks for subscribing, our new subscriber here tonight. One of our first. You guys are the best. Thanks, Ghost, for your compliment. Appreciate that. You guys are fantastic. Nathan, thanks for subscribing. So we've been working together in this garage, you and me and everyone else, on a lot of great cars here. Of course, this is our, uh, I believe this is the Tesla X, and over here I think is a minivan. James, thanks for subscribing. No, I'm just teasing. We all know this is a, this right here is a Chevy Impala. I'm just teasing you guys. It's, of course, the Dodge Charger. Uh, Levi, thanks for subscribing. Waffle, thanks for your $5, my friend. Greatly appreciate that. And Jesse, welcome aboard. You guys are fantastic. So uh, two great legendary vehicles that we've restored here. More like, uh, like 60s vehicles. Uh, spots, thanks for subscribing. All right, so we had ourselves a... Um, Actually, like a Dutch vehicle here, you see the NL license plate for Nederlands, which is Netherlands. Woo! Torres, thanks for subscribing. You guys are crazy. Thank you. And, of course, look at that. The custom Dinosaur Rat Pack logo right there. Beautiful. Everybody, thanks for all your support here tonight. Thanks for your subscriptions. And uh, you guys are fantastic. Well, anyway, without further ado, let's get to work on this pickup truck then. You guys know what that means. we got to throw her up on the rack and start taking it all apart and uh, sprucing her up and buying anything that's missing. Jeffrey, thanks for subscribing. So this right here, legendary Ford pickup truck. For those of you who are Ford fans, welcome aboard. For those of you who don't like Ford, oh, don't worry about it. Ford's still very classic and very awesome. Hayden, thanks for subscribing. So uh, we're going to be working on this one here today. We'll be seeing some other uh, vehicles too. Of course, there's the Dodge and there's the Ford here and another yet another Ford. And uh, of course, we're going to be working on a few other vehicles very soon, including the Trans Am that's back there and a few other things in our garage, such as the Shelby Cobra. So you guys are fantastic. Everybody, thanks for saying you love the videos. I love your guys' support, so that's fantastic. Current engine F100 is the inline six. Is that is that what she's got? Uh, I wish we could do some upgrades too. I can't wait. Wouldn't this thing look awesome with the supercharger? I mean, not that it needs it, but this would just look absolutely fantastic. So, welcome. You guys are legends here today. Welcome aboard. Good to have you here. Let's get started then by, uh, I guess, taking everything apart. So, let's get her up on the rack and see what we got to do. She's going to go have sky high here as so we have to pull off the tires. We're going to have to get all the... Uh, we'll start with the exhaust and the tires first. I wonder what the original color of this thing is. Is it green or is it this primer? No, oh, the factory color is like this, like a pearl gray or like maybe a white color. I, I don't know what we'll do. We'll do a couple of different paint jobs on this one. But paint, we're not going to worry about that for now. For now, let's get these tires off and let's get started. All right, there we go. We got turbo skill on those uh, tire removals. Now, we used white walls before on our uh, our Dodge, and I think we got to do the same here. And I think, you know what I'm thinking? Let's let's give her a try with, like, matte black. Let's see how that looks. We'll, we'll see there. Hi there, Giannis. Hello, everyone in chat. Good to see you all. You guys are saying the videos are amazing. Well, you guys' support is amazing. So thanks for being awesome viewers. Thank you very much for putting a little diesel fuel in the, in the tank here tonight, Waffle, with your $5. And welcome to all you. Kesh, Keshan, Green, thank you for subscribing. Welcome aboard, folks. Feel welcome to hit that subscribe button. Your name will pop up here. Welcome aboard. Yeah, S. Smith, awesome. All right, we got four tires off here. At least we have four of them. That's a good start. Off to a good start. We'll work on that suspension in a second, but let's pull the exhaust off. Easton, welcome. Good to have you here. Is that only one? Does it only have the one muffler? Oh, so strange to actually be only using one exhaust. I'm so used to two lately. But that's all right. All right, we'll pull that exhaust off there. Is there any that leads up into the engine? Uh, nope. Oh, wait. Yes, there is right there. There's the front exhaust section of a 16 or a, oh, uh, an inline six. Puppy, welcome aboard. You the best. You guys are the best. All right, let's get uh, let's get rolling here. We got a lot to do. 
All right, I think we should probably start by uh, removing the uh, rest of the uh, under undercarriage uh, components mm -hmm. here, including the brake calipers and everything. Welcome aboard, everybody. Oh, you want a teal color? Well, th those are two very different colors. That's like saying tonight for dinner, let's have let's either have chicken or let's go on a roller coaster. Like that that's how different that is. You love chicken though? Oh, I love chicken too. Who doesn't love chicken? Who loves chicken and chat? Because we're going to be swinging by. I think we're going to swing by the Chick-fil-A maybe. Oh, you know it'd be really cool. This is the kind of vehicle that belongs at like a drive-in, doesn't it? Like where they ride the roller skates out to you or a drive-in movie theater. Has anybody here ever been to a drive-in movie? Th because I have. I definitely have. Has anybody, Does anyone know where in your town that there's a drive-in movie or have you ever been to one? They are awesome. They're the, they're, they're co they're the coolest. Especially if you get some people who like figure out how to put like uh, chairs and stuff in the back of their, back of their uh, chair. You know, like in the bed, they put chairs, and then they, like, have, like, movie theater seating in the back. That's awesome. You love chicken? Everybody loves chicken and movies. All right, we're all good. off to a great start here. Anybody who likes chicken and movies, you guys are going to be great. Take it to Sonic. That's right, Nick. We're swinging by the Sonic. Good to see you, Nick. Hope you're doing good, my friend. Black Flag, thanks for subs... Oh, Fang. Black Fang, thanks for subscribing. Nick got himself some new coarse hair stuff today. Nick, I'm getting jealous. I'm going to have to buy something soon. Mad Dog Gaming, thanks for subscribing. You folks are fantastic. Welcome aboard to Car Mechanic Simulator 2018. I know you guys are loving this game. I watch. I see you guys watching all these other YouTubers playing, too. It is an awesome game. Even though it had some trouble to start with, man, they really did a great job of fixing that. I praise this game. It's really fun. It's just nice to disassemble, fix, and reassemble. That's that's a lot of... That's a, that's a, that's a motto for life, isn't it? You do that with anything. I mean, you could literally do this with a house, you know? Like, people do that all the time. They buy a house, they spruce it up, they sell it on the market at a higher price. It's good. It's nice. It increases everybody's living quality. That's awesome. You love the channel? You guys are great. Everybody, thank you very much, everybody, who says they love chicken or me. I either, both are the right answer. Preferably chicken. But if you guys like me, I appreciate that support. And uh, very nice. Speaking of chicken, by the way, I could probably buy some Chick-fil-A with Waffles $5 that it gave me. Thank you very much, Waffle. You are Not only are you delicious and crispy, but also a syrupy delight. I don't know if that applies to you, but I hope, hope it means something po positive to you. I have a feeling these rubber bushings are going to have to uh, be replaced as well. All right, steering knuckles coming off. This pickup truck shouldn't be too hard, folks. This will be an easy one to do, I have a feeling, no matter what. All right, there we go. It's not as complicated as the other uh, vehicles. Steering rack will pull that out of there. Okay, good. We will uh, bring her down so we can pull the engine out, and then we'll take the, sus the rest of that suspension out. But let's work on the back end. And, of course, man, all these cars are the same. Drum brakes in the rear with the uh, you know, the uh, solid dra axle drive and such in the back. That's very good. Do red? Hmm. I, I don't know. Uh, the good thing is when we get w when it's time to paint it, don't worry. We'll give it we'll give it a couple of different tests before we actually paint it. We'll see how it looks. Oh, I thought you had to remove the brake shoe before that. All right, let's get these uh, leaf springs out of here. What do you think? Thinking, I'm thinking that's a good idea. Do farming sim 17. Yep. Uh, make sure you're a subscriber, and you'll know when we actually play that. All right. Oh, you know what? I should have taken that plate off too. A actually, I think that would just fall off. It wouldn't really stick on there. There we go. Ooh, I like that you can see the fuel tank. That's nice. You can actually see the fuel tank on this one. Very nice. You love the game and you're going to get it? That is great. You guys are great. That's awesome. Good, good. Positive days. Positive vibes, y'all. Uh, legit or cheat level? So, yeah, it is technically a cheat because um, when we uh, started playing, I have a legitimate profile that I've been playing through for real. But also a lot of people wanted to see, you know, when are you going to get this? When are you going to get that? And in order to do that, you need a ton of money. So in order to just have like a sandbox mode in the game, we quote unquote cheated in money. But I think there, you guys agree that there should be a sandbox mode where you can just pick any car you want and just take it apart. And also a career mode too. Like both would be good. I I'd love to have both. Everybody, thanks for your subscriptions, you guys. Again, if you're a subscriber here, your name will pop up. And, of course, the biggest benefit, too, is that you know when we go live. And so that way, you'll never miss a live stream. And I can say hi to you just like, uh, I don't know, Philip and Zach and Ian and Christy and Chad. Hi to you all. You're going to get the game? Oh, and both DLCs. Yes, the Mazda DLC and the uh, Dodge DLC. There's a lot of other DLC planned, too, and coming. Uh, I can't remember exactly everything, but I think I saw Pontiac, BMW, a lot of German brands on there, too. Ben, thanks for subscribing. So for those of you wanting to see more European automobiles, oh, don't worry. It will it will appeal with the automobile to you. All right, let's get the rest of these screws out. Those rubber bushings, they get me every time. All right, Lee Springs, you're out. Knuckle, you're out. And that means that we can finally take off the uh, drive shaft here and the, and the rear axle. Beautiful. All right, four bolts on either side here. Very nice. 
Mazda, no? Oh, Mazdas are cool. You know, there e every every car company has its own fantastic vehicles. Like you, you got to admit, like if you don't like Ford, you still got to say that Mustangs are awesome. If you don't like uh, Asian manufacturers or whatnot, you know, for some of their smaller designs, you got to say they're pretty cool. Farming, thanks for subscribing. You guys are awesome. Don, welcome aboard. Everybody who wants to join our little maintenance crew here tonight, hit that subscribe button, folks. Feel welcome here. Hey, we're off to a great start. Ian plays. Welcome. All right, let's go ahead and lower this down. We're going to pull the engine out now and a few other components. Then we're going to put that on our... Actually, we better slide the crane over here. Where is that thing? Ah, there she is. Uh, Joe Bro, thanks for subscribing. Let's throw the engine crane over to... Uh, is it car lifter A? Oh, it was on the other side. Oh, darn. It's three. Michael, thanks for subscribing. Welcome, 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 everybody. All right, we'll swing you over to three. There we go. And we'll pull that engine out here. As soon as we take a few extra components out, let's get that radiator out of here. There we go. Let's get that battery out. Let's get the brake servo out. And let's go ahead and see if we can pull the engine out. Now, in order to do this, uh, we also have to take the gearbox out. So I, I kind of forgot about that. We'll just uh, disassemble that. We should be able to pull it out right there. How am I doing tonight, says Brian. L Brian, let me check. Doing great, Brian. Thanks for asking. Appreciate that. We all live in America. Well, I live in America, but I have been to Europe before. Uh, Unleash the Beast, thanks for subscribing. I have been to the Netherlands and uh, all sorts of other great countries over there. Beautiful. Europe, very beautiful. You know, what I, you know what I think I like the best is European roads with American cars on them. Man, does it look beautiful. All right, I think that's pretty much enough here. We can, eh, we'll go ahead and take these off, but we can actually do this when we're on the bench. But that should be it to get the engine out of there. There we go. Had to take the gearbox off, too. All right, we'll lower it. We'll get the engine out of there. And we'll start taking apart the interior. Uh, how do you uh, do Super Chat? Yeah, oh, yeah. If you would like to support me, if you think, hey, this guy's really cool, he's kind of weird, but I'd like to give him some money or something like that, GTA, thanks for subscribing. Uh, there's a little square with a dollar sign in it down there. If you click on that, you can swing. There's a little slider ball. You can give me a dollar up to $500 if you wanted or, or more, but don't, don't worry about that. If you'd like to support me, do so. Something awesome will pop up on the screen. You can also support uh, via PayPal in the description. And by the way, since you folks are so nice tonight, you know what? I'm getting everybody a free game. Tell you what, every single person watching right now, free game for you guys. Here's where it is. First link in the description, you can download a game called Crossout for free. So if you would like a free game, it is waiting for you in the description. Free of charge, you can go ahead and install it tonight. It's only a couple of gigs. If you don't like it, you can always uninstall it and be like, meh, that game wasn't for me. But hey, you know what, for free, if somebody said to you, hey, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to give you can have this uh, free car. And if you don't like it, you can take it back. <laughs> awesome. You, you grab it, you drive it. If you don't like it, you bring it back. That's all. No risk, folks. It's a great game. All right. Now, how do I pull the engine out of here? Oh, yes. We need to use the... We actually need to use the crane to do it. Uh, pull out. There we go. Perfect. All right. Now it's magically on the crane. Um, it's, it's actually in our pocket, if you think about it. If you look at the inventory, it's magically in the uh, pocket. My name is Jeff. Thank you for sobbing. Okay. Let's throw this on the... Uh, oh, whoa. V8 two-carb. Where did that come from? Well, anyway, I think it's this one right here. There we go. Ooh, boy, is that dirty. Whoo, boy. But that's a beautiful blue, isn't it? That's a really cool... Oh, this is going to be a really fun engine to work on. This is going to be awesome. This is an inline six uh, from Ford. So any Ford fans in, in chat? I, I would hope so. I would hope so. Uh, how am I doing? Guys, I'm, gr I'm great, everybody. I'm just doing great. Thank you. Th thank you very much for asking. Everything's going well. All right, let's pull the fenders off. Let's do a little bit of body work. Playing, uh, played Ranger, thanks for subscribing. Let's go ahead and pull some of these headlights off. I wonder if we can grab the bumper. Yep, we sure can. We'll uh, do a little bit of the exterior work. Are there windows on it? It looks like... The oh, no, the back window's still in place. Oh, that that is a gorgeous window. They just don't make them like they used to, folks. They just they just don't. Tail lights are going to have to be pulled off, too. This thing is just going to be naked, completely naked. Uh, say hi to Space Engineers. It's cool. Oh, you like Space? Oh, the oh the game. The game, yes. That is a good game as well. How long am I streaming? For as long as it takes us to do this truck. Don't worry, folks. Again, if you always want to know how long I'm streaming for and stuff, I, 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 even I don't know. So, Justin, thanks for subscribing. It's just until we all get bored. And then we all go off to eat chicken because chicken's awesome. All right, we're going to pull out the, the seat. We're going to pull out the steering wheel. Very good. Look at that. That is our that is our vehicle. Now I'd love to paint it. Now I wish we could put it on some rollers and bring it into the uh, into the uh, paint room here, but uh, we can't at the moment. So what we can do though is we can do a little body work on it. So let's go ahead and get started with that. Oh, there's our battery charger. Here's what we want to use. Our welder here is going to be very important. We need to actually uh, work on uh, the body of this car a little bit. Not looking too good. She's she's kind of beat up a little bit. Have I ever worked in a shop? I've worked in uh, a couple of shops, but they were like in high school and such. Electronics and uh, metals. 
Did a lot of welding. I'm very good with an arc welder. Oh, what, what's up here? I thought we welded this body. Oh, didn't it work? It kind of it kind of worked. Why did it not do this side though? That's strange. Maybe we have to paint it or something. Let's do the interior uh, body as well. Where's the? Uh, oh, there it is. Our interior detailing kit over here. And let's go ahead and move. Swing that over to uh, car lifter C, and we're gonna go ahead and clean this up. I love when you can move. Doesn't it look awesome when you've got all your stuff around the car? Joshua, thanks for subscribing. You got your uh, you got your engine crane, your welder. You've got you know all your. Uh, cleaning tools and everything like that, brushes and everything. Captain Plays, welcome aboard. Hi, everyone in chat. Good to see you all. Welcome aboard. Again, remember, free game waiting for you. First link in the description, folks, waiting right for you. All right, what else can we pull out here? There shouldn't be anything else to pull out, yeah. All right, let's go ahead and do a little bit of the interior detailing now. Very good. I didn't seem to fix this side of the car. I'm going to try this again. Did I, for whatever reason, click no? All right, so we welded again for no yeah another thousand dollars spent on nothing. William, thanks for subscribing. I don't know why this side of the truck uh, won't fix up, but eh, could just it might just be a game glitch. So we already tried to repair. Looks very nice though. This is its factory color. Very beautiful. Very very beautiful. Okay, let's get to work, folks, on that engine. Who wants to see some engine work here today in Car Mechanic Simulator 2018? I do. I definitely want to work on an engine. Good. Let's get started. There's a lot of pieces to take apart here. And boy, oh boy, is that dirty and gross, and it's going to need a little, lo a lot of love and care. All right, well, let's get started then by uh, working on our engine. We're going to take apart the air filter. We're going to work our way, you know, top down, see if we can take it all apart. Fender. Oh, take the fender off. Oh, that's a fender. Oh, right. Yes, a flock. Thanks for subscribing. I forgot it was a fender. Like, look at how seamlessly it fit with the thing. You guys are right. I spent money when I didn't have to. Yay. Excellent. That's a good. That's a good excuse to actually pull off the suspension too. Thanks for reminding me, folks. Appreciate that. All right, fenders off. We're good to go. Thanks for the tip, folks, or the reminder. See, that's why I need you guys in the shop. You guys are the true pros. All right, let's pull off the rest of the suspension and let's pull out that uh, sway bar too, shall we? Front sway bar. You're coming with me, and those rubber bushings are coming out. Then it is time to work on that engine, and the truck will be 100 percent. And then we'll we'll put it all back together in a moment or two. So don't worry, folks. We are not leaving tonight's stream until this beautiful classic Ford is up to 100 percent beauty and prestige restored to her. I I always hate saying former glory because aren't these cars still glorious? They're just still so wonderful. All right, let's go ahead and. Uh, fix up this engine now. So we took apart a little bit of the air filter. Let's continue to do that. Here comes our carburetor. And uh, here comes the rest of the engine, which will include the manifolds, both intake and exhaust. Boy, oh boy, a lot of bolts on this one. There we go. Very, very good. Hey, folks, welcome aboard. For those of you who are new around these parts, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Again, your name will pop up here, and I'll give you a big old shout-out for being a new subscriber to the channel. Uh, we've got over almost like 220,000 people who have chose to be a part of... Uh, of our, of our streams in our community, so I'd like to say hello to everybody in chat, and uh, though I can't give every single one of you a shout-out, I'd like to say at least hi. Hi to everybody watching, and welcome aboard. Do I have Steam? Yep, that's what I have this game on. It is available on Steam. It will be available on PS4 and Xbox, though I do not know when, so you'll have to just Google it, and the answer should be there. Uh, Hyper Gamer, welcome aboard. Nice to have you with us. Jeez, I hate... Oh, boy. Th I, I don't like when I have to remove all the rocker arms. Oh, boy. This is... I hate it! It's fun when it's all just one thing and then it's easy to pull out, but we got to do these rocker arms one at a time, one at a time. Well, hello everyone in chat. Good to see you all. Hope you're all doing great. Oh, you subscribed? Yep, sorry about that, Elijah. Sometimes when you guys subscribe, if you have your subscription set to private on YouTube, your name won't pop up, but I appreciate you guys at least, uh, you know, subscribing. Sometimes it doesn't work. Yeah, the Charger? Yeah, you see the Charger? Yep, yeah, we worked on that last time. Before that, we worked on the Ford Mustang. Today, it's the Ford 100. F100, and then uh, I think we're going to work on some classic luxury vehicles this weekend. So if anybody wants to see some cool luxury vehicles be rebuilt and uh, restored, don't worry, that's up next. Good to have you all here again. Ah oh, man, I'm loving this. These push rods, not so much though. They don't love me. I don't love them. They're always there's always so many of them. Ugh, this is like the the worst part right here. Yeah, I should play Space Engineers. Yeah, I've played that game before. It's a really cool game too. You get to design your own spaceship. Sir Xavier, thank you for subscribing. Welcome aboard. Do I? Oh, did I work on a Daytona? I did not, but I I do have one in the garage that we will be repairing sometime soon. Don't worry, all your classics will be worked on someday, folks. Jordan, thank you for subscribing. All right, let's get this hidden engine head apart. I think what we need to do first is there's something we're missing. Oh, the spark plugs. I think we have to pull them out first. Yeah. Ooh, wow. There's quite a few on this one. And uh, Nathan, thanks for subscribing. I might miss some of you. I might not get everyone a shout out, but. 
please know that my uh, thanks is the same. You were waiting for this for the the, the Ford uh, F100 rebuild? Yeah. Jackson, thanks for subscribing. This game is so cool. Like the the thing about uh, car mechanic simulators, there's so much to do that I e even if I just like quit work for a week, I wouldn't have had enough time to do everything. Dylan, welcome. All right, let's get that uh, distributor cap off. Let's get the ignition uh, rotor and distributor out of there. Let's go ahead and we're going to try to get all the way back down to that engine block and then we need to repair everything. So first comes the serpentine belt. Oh, actually the other one has to come off first. And then we'll go ahead and take off the other uh, belt here, serpentine belt A. And then we can start taking a, f a few things out. Wow, this car actually has power steering. Very interesting, Ford. Very interesting. Nice work. Albert Surgoy, thanks for subscribing. Today's your birthday. Well, happy birthday to everybody in chat who has their birthday today or recently had it or it's soon. Happy birthday to all of you. Mason, welcome aboard. Water pump is coming out with four bolts. Boom, boom, boom. And there she comes. That's a nice engine. I like this one. Gaming channel. I wonder what you do. Gaming channel, do you do a lot of like what? I would assume like uh, puppy product reviews. Do you do like little treat reviews for dogs? Nah, you probably do gaming, right? All right, let's pull off that timing cover. And then underneath the timing cover, it's not a watch, folks. It's a timing belt. Yeah, there you go. Oh, good timing, too. Ho, ho! Uh, Kill Killadar, thank you for subscribing. Welcome aboard, folks. Good to have you all here. Let's go ahead and flip this thing upside down. Oh, you know what? Raptor committed a cardinal sin. I took the... You know what really sucks is that you can't... I don't think you can drain the oil here. You, you, you should be able to, like... I don't think you can do this. I don't think it matters either once you have it on the engine crane or if you're doing an old car like this, but... I think if you take off the engine, or the oil pan of the engine, it's going to spill all over. At least it should if you didn't do things right, like I didn't. Oh, you subscribed. Well, welcome aboard. Welcome to all of our new subscribers here today. Let's get this thing upside down. Let's take off the oil pan and get underneath there. Mitchell, welcome. Good to have you here. All right, oil pan B is being removed. Yep, we, we do have a, do a Daytona. We will be building one of those sometime soon, but since it's... Uh, you know, since we kind of already did, we've been doing a lot of cars, so I thought it was time for a pickup truck. And I'm sure you guys are happy to see that. I sure am. One of my first cars was a uh, pickup truck, by the way. A, a, a pickup is a very good vehicle to have. If you do not have a pickup, you had better have a friend who has a pickup, because uh, the moment that you don't have a pickup is the moment you need to move a bunch of couches, or uh, you bought a big TV and it's way too big for your car, or something like that. You know, there's a million different reasons to have a pickup, or more, th or at the very least, a friend with a pickup truck. Very good to have that. You just got Roblox? Okay. Well, I hope you enjoy Roblox. You subscribe. Wonderful. Thank you, everyone. Welcome all, all of our new subscribers. Hey, I got a I got a gift for all of you tonight. First link in the description is a free game where you can build vehicles and uh, go out to do some war with them. So if you guys are interested in building your own cars, boom, free game right down there in the description. Go ahead and play Cross out today and get yourself uh, Car Mechanic Simulator 2018. A very good game, I must say. Uh, Freedom Ring. Thank you very much for subscribing. You guys are fantastic. All right, let's go ahead and get that piston with Conrad out of there. And another piston. All right, so we should be up to six now. There we go. And they're all good. All right, and that means the crankshaft can come out after we remove that last bearing. Uh, that one escaped me. Come on, you're coming with. Ta-da! That should be it. Did we miss one? Oh, we might be missing a bearing. Hmm, are we missing a bearing? What are we missing? Oh, of course, the uh, this thing. Oh, well, no wonder I can't see it, because the the clamp is in the way. Uh, wired Tips, thanks for subscribing. There we go. All right, crankshaft's coming out now. There we go. Yay! All right, and look at that. Raptor did him. Oh, look, it vanished. Wow. Cool, bro. Thanks for subscribing. All right, folks, we got a lot of work to do. We got a lot of uh, parts to repair here. So let's go ahead and start repairing all of these parts. Every single piece on this truck needs to be repaired. So let's see if we can do that. If not, we'll just rebuy it. Can you? Yes, I can. And welcome aboard to the community. Good to have you here. Sorry you haven't been on for the streams. Well, Gustavo, welcome back. Again, it's nice to have you guys here. If you do hit that subscribe button, you guys will be notified any time that we do go live, and you'll get a nice old shout-out, too, for joining us. So never uh, never feel like, uh, you know, it's a bad thing that you've been away. You got stuff to do. Even I got stuff to do, too. I love being a YouTuber, but sometimes, you know, other things come first. But why is my name Raptor? Because I thought it sounded pretty cool. Does it sound Does it, does it? sound cool? Hi there. I like apples and banana. <laughs> wow, that's a very descriptive name. I should have named myself. I like pizza and naps and then taking another nap after eating more pizza. But I don't think that would have fit, so I think that's why I went with Raptor. Ooh, a lot of these parts are not repairing nicely. Looks like we'll be buying a lot of stuff, but that's okay. Daryl, welcome aboard. Good to have you here tonight. 
You can't find the super chat button. If you can't find the super chat button, you can always support us in the in the description. There's a link for PayPal, so you can support us via PayPal right now. If you do, hey, if you donate a dollar, guess what's going to happen? Boom, your name's going to pop up on the screen. Epic Gamer says cringe. What's what's going on? Are you looking at your photo albums again of family trips? Oh no, don't do that. Come on, we're here to be nice and be happy. Come on now, be a participant. Be a be a nice member of chat. Let's all get along. Oh, build a, yes, a Daytona like the Interceptor? Yeah, yeah. I know you guys, okay. Well, you guys definitely want to see that uh, Daytona, so guess what? We'll be doing the Daytona. Not yet, but sometime in the future. So that's why you guys should hit that subscribe button, because then you'll know when we're building the Daytona. Wow, a lot of these parts are not going well. Wow, we've had to repair so much, I can't believe it. All right, let's double time it. All right, there we go. Woo! Okay, very good. He says, thanks for making the videos. Well, thanks for being a viewer, Heath. Okay, now, let's see. Everything's been repaired. The engine's uh, got to be rebuilt. Um, let's go ahead and paint it. So that means we're going to fix the suspension first. So what we're going to do is we're going to throw the tires, the suspension, most of the body parts back onto it. We're going to roll it into our paint lab over here. And then we're going to give it our nice paint job, drop the engine in, and then we're going to go out to... Uh, where you guys want to go out for dinner? You guys want to go to Sonic? Uh, treats are on me, everybody. I think for like $3 we can buy 13 million corn dogs or something, so... There you go. Good to see everybody in chat. Welcome aboard, everybody. Very entertaining. Hey, you guys are entertaining, too, so thanks for being a great audience tonight. Um, let's see. Let's lower this thing back down here take a look. Did we get all the pieces out of the interior? Yes, we did. Okay. So we're going to go ahead and raise her back up, and we're going to start throwing the pieces back on it. I wanted to make sure we had absolutely nothing on here before we started rebuilding. All right. Assemble mode begin. Oh, wait. That's the wrong assemble mode. William, welcome aboard. Normal mode. And part mount. There we go. All right, front suspension, you're going on, and then we're going to need about 3 million of these rubber bushings because, man, are they... You never can have enough of these rubber bushings, folks. In fact, I'm just going to buy, like, 15 right now because they're super valuable. They're, they're, they're like, the, the cheapest thing in the game, and a lot of things use them. So we're going to go ahead and find rubber bushings. Let's go ahead and buy, like, 20 of these things. You can never have enough rubber bushings. The suspension uses these things like crazy. Let's buy 25 of them for future repairs and stuff. Good thing is we have a huge warehouse, so if we buy stuff that we didn't mean to, it doesn't matter. It goes into the warehouse. Cool, bro. Welcome aboard. Okay, let's see. Uh, let's go ahead and continue to drop in some rubber bushings and such. Play Scrap Mechanic. That's a great game, too, isn't it? I love Scrap Mechanic. Now, for those of you suggesting that I play other games, uh, make sure that you're a subscriber so that way when we do play them, you never miss a video. Want me to play Roblox? Where's the farming sim videos? Well, make sure you hit the subscribe button so you guys know when our latest video goes out. All right, let's continue with these rubber bushings. We've almost got it here, folks. All right, that's it. It's all uh, locked in there. Christy, thanks for subscribing. So this is good news. Off to a great start. We've got our uh, suspension started here. Very good. Let's go ahead and start throwing on some pieces to the side. Going to go ahead and now start getting... Uh, the steering rack in there. Ooh, that's bad condition. All right, let's grab one of those. All right, steering rack it is. Okay, so we need the steering rack. Wow, this music's good. You guys like this music? Sorry, it just makes me want to get down. Okay, steering rack, you're up. Boom. And then let's see here. We want the inner tie rod. Ooh, boy. Well, we're going to need to buy some of those. We're going to try to do 100, so uh, let's see. Inner tie. Inner tie rod. All right two of these bad boys. I think we may as well buy an outer tie rod because we tried to uh, repair those and I just have a feeling that those repairs probably didn't go well. So, all right, let's get those uh, pieces in here. Now, folks, I want to know from you, by the way, if you could work on any classic pickup truck, any pickup truck ever. Well, hell, let's even say modern day pickups. Like if you could have yourself a new boom right now, modern day Ford or, Sh or GMC or whomever, what pickup truck would you want to have in your garage to work on and to own as your own? Uh, Kyra, thank you for subscribing. What would I want? I think I would want, ooh, pickup truck-wise, Ford Raptor, for obvious reasons. Because I can wreck it and claim the insurance money? No, I'm just kidding, because it's got my name on it. F-150, oh, but what, but what year, though? But what year? you got to give me a year, because if you just say, yeah, I want a Ford pickup, that, that, there's a mil that's, that's, that's a big... That's that's a big uh, that's a, that's big that's big list that's big list. All right, looks like oh folks are saying Austin Lee saying 58 Ford F1 F100 Ford Ranger 95 nice Gambino thanks for subscribing 53 Ford yes Grayson yes I think I'd agree with you there actually 57 Chevy uh, 95 Ford very nice uh, Ford Raptor yeah yeah there you go all right a lot of people big big old Ford fans here good that's good but hey Chevy too. A lot of good Chevy vehicles out there, and GMC as well. And the nice thing is, is that, you know, 
If companies are competing for your business, guess who wins? We do, because otherwise they'd be making cars the same way if there were never any improvements. I mean, think about it. Cars now have, like, more computers in them than a hospital in 1990. Think about it. Faisal, thank you for subscribing. Welcome aboard, everybody. Welcome, one and all, to the channel. Good to have you all here. If it's your first time around these parts, go ahead and hit that subscribe button so you don't miss out on our next time. Crying Wolf, thanks for subscribing. we got a lot to do here today, folks, so you're not missing anything. You're just in time. Oh, F, uh, oh, Ford Raptor in gold. That's nice. Very nice. You guys, <laughs> everyone's cheering everyone on to hit that like button. Well, t folks, uh, to be honest, if you truly want to see more of this content, it is a great idea to hit that like button. Not that, like, YouTubers getting anything special or magical out of it or that we're trying to trick you. But what we are trying to do is we're trying to entertain you. So if you'd like to uh, be entertained and see more of this, hit that like button right now. Scroll down. Boom, boom, boom. Look at all those people hitting that like button. Boom, 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 boom. Be a part of all those people uh, hitting that like button and subscribing, too, by uh, doing that. And it'll be nice to have you here. Welcome, everybody. Hi there, uh, Heidi Walker. Good to see you in chat. Hi there. Go on a spending spree? We kind of are. I mean, we're buying all new parts for this Ford uh, F100. What year do you guys think this uh, this pickup truck's from? Oh, boy. We're going to have to buy a, a brake cylinder. Let's see. Oh, let's see. Brake. Let's see. Brake cylinder. Oh, caliper cylinder. That's what it's called. So what year do you guys think this pickup truck is? Oh, you joined our Steam group? Guys, we got over six thousand six thousand we got six thousand people in our steam group so join our steam group in the description and you guys can come say hi to me in the comment section also if you want to say hi to me and send me cool pictures of stuff you know what i'd really love to see if you guys if does anyone here play american I, i'm sorry i'm dear coming to my eyes so beautiful america also a peanut went down my throat oh my god <laughs> all right but yes if you uh, guys really like american truck simulator or euro truck uh, please do send me pictures of your truck. Dalton, thanks for subscribing. So send it to me on Twitter, at RaptorGamer on Twitter. Uh, you guys can find those links in the description. Come say hi to me. We also have t-shirts, a cool t-shirt store, too. Uh, if you'd like to get a cool uh, t-shirt. For example, hey, you guys want to see something really cool? Check this out. You guys can get a t-shirt with this logo on it. You see that cool Raptor logo? It, may, it might be a little hard to see from here. Let's, let's, lower the, let's lower the lift down all the way. So if you guys want to see a super cool t-shirt, I'm really proud of these because the design turned out fantastic. Theo, thanks for subscribing. Hey, how do you put it all the way down? Oh, I bet I know. There we go. All right, check this out. Yes, yeah, lower our baby all the way down. There we go. Jose, thanks for subscribing. Okay, so check that out. You can get a t-shirt with that cool logo on it, the dinosaur, if, if you're interested. And uh, there you go. Flame Wolf, thanks for subscribing. The uh, Dino Diner will come when it comes, folks. You'll see the episode. Make sure you're subscribed so you don't miss it. You will be surprised what's going to happen next. All right, let's get the rest of the outer tie rods in there. We're looking pretty good here. So now it's time to get the rest of the suspension on, uh, which includes... Oh, you know what? The front exhaust section could be thrown up in there. Oh, no, I guess not because it's in kind of bad shape. Let's get the rest of the suspension arms on then. All right, let's go for a record reassembly of this thing. Welcome, everybody. Uh, I hope you're all having a great day. Again, if you haven't already, you guys can get a free game in the description. I would like to remind everybody of that. I don't want anyone missing out on that. Oh, boy, that's that's bad. We better buy ourselves some double wishbone shock absorbers and get that assembled over here at the spring polar. Okay, well, both of those shock absorbers were looking pretty poor, so uh, double wishbone. Uh, let's see, for the front, and then we need to get a spring. And let's go ahead and grab two of these. By the way, this is music that is available in the game, so there's many other different options that you can listen to as well. Uh, double wishbone, what's the other thing? Front cap, is it? Front spring something? No, front uh, front spring cap. What is it? Front? Hmm, it's something front. Oh, boy, if I click that, that's going to be a million different things. Oh, boy. Um, there we go. Front shock absorber cap. That's what I'm looking for. All right, we're going to need two of those. Very good. Uh, this game will be available on Xbox and PS4, but I'm not sure when. CTL, thanks for subscribing. Oh, all right, got to put these together. Boom, boom, boom. All right, and begin. All right, we're casting a magical spell on this thing. Oh, you guys are great. Thanks, everyone, for all your positive support. What a great audience we've got here today. All right, let's get the uh, other spring on here. Welcome, welcome. Boom, boom. Oh, oh, yes. Oh, wait, there are no items to work. What? I thought I bought one of those caps. Didn't I buy... Oh, oh I bought two of them, I thought. Did I not? I Maybe I didn't. I could have I could have goofed, but I swore I bought two. Maybe in my excitement, I only bought one. 
Join parts. One, two, three. That's a GG. John, welcome aboard. Good to have you here. Does Whiskey have a... Yeah, he has a channel. You, uh... Well, not really. He doesn't really put videos up. Everybody I, I play with usually has a channel, but anybody who has a channel that's very active, you can find in the description or on the main page. So let's get those springs up here, folks. It's been forever. Well, welcome, Dalton. All right, let's see here. Let's go ahead and get our power. Oh, there we go. That's what we're looking for. All right. One front spring is in. Let's get the other front spring on. Oh, look at this. we got to put in our bottom suspension first. I thought we were all done over here. Aiden, welcome aboard. You guys are great. Welcome, welcome. Uh, can I show all the cars and such? Well, tonight, let's work on the truck. Otherwise, we're going to be working. Our, we gotta get we got to get this job done, then we'll go take a tour. Cam, thanks for subscribing. we got an engine to work on, too, folks. As soon as the suspension is done, we're going to be painting it. So stick around, because we got to paint this thing. We, got, we also got to get a front suspension thing, too. Uh, what is it? No, it's an upper. It's an upper something. Upper suspension arm. That's what we want. $170 for that. That sounds rather affordable. All right. Boom, boom, boom. That's what... We need perfect. All right, let's go ahead and get these in. Boom. Boom, boom. That's very nice. All right, perfect. So now we can go ahead and put in our front sway bar, which I think is, yep, didn't fully get repaired. There we go. And, oh boy, what is it? Front sway. Is it just a regular front sway bar? I hope it is. I hope it's nothing fancy. Where is it? Front sway bar, right? Ah, darn it. It was the B. Nah, that's okay. Not a big loss. Okay, let's see gonna get that front sway bar in very nice oh wait a minute actually we forgot one part out here I just saw that it is the uh, the one that always escapes me this little guy the front the sway art bar end link thing hmm. v12 yes I would love to put a v12 in this but unfortunately uh, you cannot swap engines at the very current moment but uh, uh, that would be great wouldn't it be awesome to just do some full-out upgrades be nice. It's like, yeah, we're going to take this little Toyota Corolla and put uh, 12,000 horsepower under the hood. Oh, wow, geez. Yeah. All right, let's see here. Um, there we go. Front end link B over on this side. Okay, good. And then we need to buy an exhaust, like front exhaust of some sort. Oh, boy. Um, that's like a million different exhausts. Well, we want an I-6, and I think it's an I-6B. So it's, I think it's this one here. Can you drive in this game? Yes, you can. There should be a race mode coming in soon, though it's not fully installed yet. Uh, there's a lot of things that need to be finished in the game, but at this current moment, there's so much to do that it's really not something that... I mean, it'd be cool if it was there, but... Raptor for life. Thanks for subscribing. All right, let's see here. Um, boom. Muffler's all good. Sandy Kirk, thank you for subscribing. Yeah, you want me to paint it black? I think that's what we're going to go with. We'll see about that in a moment. All right, the exhaust is on. Let's go ahead and now put on the uh, rear end uh, axle. Dr oh boy, that's bad. All right, oh boy, that's bad. Okay, oh, there we go. Wait, I thought it was... Uh, let's see, Lee spring rear drive axle. I typed in Lee, oh, it's hyphenated, that's why. I'm... And uh, Crunkies, thank you for subscribing. Let's get that in there, very good. Let's get our leaf springs in there, very good. 100% on both of these, so let's go ahead and throw those up there, and then we'll get those rubber bushings on. Folks, I've got this down to a science. Like, vehicle maintenance, I mean, I make Midas look bad. I mean, it's like, we, we disassembled and reassembled a truck, and, like, we, we can do it in an hour. Yeah, again, if you guys subscribe, your name should pop up here. If it doesn't, it just means your subscriptions were set to private. But welcome aboard, everybody. Go ahead and hit that subscribe button so I can say hi to you. Welcome aboard. Good to have you with us. Rear shock absorber is what we want here. Actually, wait a minute. I don't even have to close this. Here we go. Oh, boy. Is it A or B, though? Andrew, thanks for subscribing. I have a feeling it's B, but watch it Watch it be A. Just to, just to toy with me. Watch this. Oh, it's B. Very good. Yeah, we did it right. Me, good deck game. All right, let's go ahead and get over to the other side. We're going to throw that on there. Uh, where is it there? Oh, we got to put... Oh, there it is. She was hiding up here. There's our other leaf spring, or our little uh, shock absorber for the leaf spring. Rear axle housing. Boom, you're on there. And let's go ahead and uh, let's throw that gas tank in there. Oh, boy. 83%? No, thank you. Andrew, thanks for subscribing. Okay. Uh, fuel tank. F-U-E-L. There we go. Me good spell. All right. Let's see. Uh, 
Coop, thanks for subscribing. Welcome aboard, everybody. Nice to have you here. Thanks for tuning in. Car Mechanic Simulator 2018 plus one, which is 20. No, I'm sorry. I meant to make a joke about 17, but it failed miserably. Note to self, no jokes. All right, super serious mode now. Fuel pump. All right, there we go. All right, perfect. The fuel pump's all good. Very nice. And uh, let's go ahead and uh, there we go. Get all this mixed in here. David Smith, welcome aboard. All right, drum cylinder. There you go. Lost Phoenix, welcome. Awesome, you gotta go. All right, anybody leaving, taking care, and have a good one. For those of you just joining us, go ahead and hit that subscribe button, just like RC Bro did, so that way you never miss a moment of the action here on the channel. Welcome everybody. All right, let's get that brake drum over here. Ooh, they're not 100% though. Jack Worrell, welcome aboard. All right, let's see. Uh, brake drum. Might as well just type drum here. And let's buy two of those. I have a feeling that they're not going to be in good shape. You subscribe. Well, welcome, everybody. Nice to have you all here. Welcome, welcome. All right, oh, and then we can throw the tire on. So we're going to wait on the tire for just a second. We're going to get the other side ready here. We do need to buy new tires. Uh, Gingenator, thank you for subscribing. But I think what we will do is we will wait on the... Uh, new tire purchase until a little bit later. Let's see, we want wheel hub four, and I believe we want two of those. Some of you getting a leg? Oh, that's that's no good. All right, let's see here. Wheel hub four. If you have any leg, just go ahead and have uh, mom or your sister turn off Netflix. Usually it's because people have too many things open. That could be part of the problem sometimes. Aiden, welcome. All right, four bolts to connect the wheel drive here, and uh, we're going to go ahead and get the brake shoe on. There we go. If the shoe fits, wear it. PR20, welcome. Turn down for what? Yes. All right, let's get that. All right, perfect. The tires are there. All right, very nice. And Jackson, thanks for subscribing. Okay, we should be ready to throw some tires on now. And uh, we're just going to use the same regular tires. Uh, we're going to put her into the uh, paint shop now. So get ready, everybody. It's time to suggest your ideas for favorite colors and such. Oh, I never hit enter. Oh, yeah, yeah, that's true. You can, If you hit enter, you can skip clicking okay. I guess I'm so used to just using the, uh, like I'm actually making a purchase. All right, let's get this thing uh, into the, we're going to try to roll this into the paint shop, so let's get our regular tires back on. Oh, I'm missing something from over here. What is missing? Ah, of course, the darn wheel bearings. Ah, uh, those always get away from me. Eh, not a problem. Perfect. All right, wheel number one going on. Now, again, we're just going to put garbage tires on for now. So uh, so we're ju we're just gonna put these tires on just for now, just to get her into the uh, into the uh, paint thing, and then we're gonna buy new tires afterwards. You love the videos, I love your guys' support. Thanks for being subscribers here today, Colton Long. Thanks for subscribing. All right, wheel bearing going in, hub cap going on, and the tire itself. And again, just bad tires for now. You can never get tired of this, folks. I'm telling you. All right. Let's get another one of this up here. Very good. Boom, boom, boom. Let's go, let's go. Actually, you know what? We're going to just take these tires off anyway so we don't have to do the whole star pattern thing. Knox, thanks for subscribing. It's not like we're going to lose uh, gas mileage on the way from the lift over to the paint shop, right? All right, there we go. Perfect. Okay, we are good to go, so let's move this thing now. We should be ready to, uh, oh boy. Oh, actually, I don't think it has a hood either. we got to purchase one of those. Uh, let's bring her into the move car, into the paint shop. Now, if we paint this without, without putting all those parts on there, it's probably not going to paint everything, right? Clayton, thanks for subscribing. So we might have to get all the parts assembled, don't we? Yes, yes. All right, let's go to assemble mode here. All right, boom. Oh, boy, these fenders. I don't know what this person was thinking. All right. We just need to get all the fenders on so we can paint the thing. Oh, we do need to get the back end on, too. Uh, we got to go to the body shop for that. You live in Minnesota, Jake? Wonderful. Welcome. All right, let's go ahead and assemble everything here. We need the smith. Uh, we need the tail... Not the tail lights, but the uh, back end. Actually, I think we need a front right fender. Is that right? Or no, it's the... I think it's the rear right fender. I think that's what we need. Let's buy one of those. Oh, we might need... Uh, I'm not going to worry about anything we don't have to paint. So, uh, side view mirrors and... So oh, wait, we need a hood. That's one thing I forgot about. Let's grab a hood, too. There we go. Ooh, that looks nice. That looks nice. 
Am I forgetting the back rubber bushings? Am I? All right, we'll take a look at that in a second. But for now, let's paint. Don't worry, it's always an ongoing job. Jordan, thanks for subscribing. After this, we're going to work on the engine, so this should be everything. Are we missing a door? Oh, boy. Oh, maybe I just pulled that off. I hope we're not missing a door. Oh, we might be. Oh, my God, we're missing a door. That guy, thanks for subscribing. Are we missing the right door? Oh, my goodness, no left or right doors. I thought we had more. Uh, let's see, left and right door. Yep, Raptor is from Minnesota. I live in Minneapolis. I'll be having, uh, in uh, about 10 days, all of the Rat Pack are coming to hang out with me. We're going to go to some amusement parks. We're going to uh, do some other secret things that I can't talk about. They're going to be awesome. You guys are going to love it. We're going to vlog everything, so don't worry. You won't miss out on a thing. Dark Thought, thanks for subscribing. All right, now, I think that's everything we want to paint for now. Boy, oh, boy, does it look, uh, it's starting to look nice. And we'll get the lights and everything else installed a little bit later. But for now, let's reel this beast in and over to the paint shop. Ta-da! There she is. Look at that! Ooh! I guess we didn't even have, We can go through the side door. Okay, folks. Now, here's my idea. Let's go ahead and take a look at the colors. And let's go ahead and find out what we want to paint this thing. Now, here's my idea, right? Here's what I thought we could paint this. Let me know if you like my idea. Let's see if I can find where it is, though. Oh, uh, let's see. Now, uh, this with white wall tires. What, what do you guys think? You got you guys think that's pretty sweet? You guys like the you guys like the black? What about this though? Look at look at this one. Yeah, that looks pretty cool too. Maximize pixels. Welcome aboard. All right, we already have what, red and blue. We already have a red and blue car, so those are out at least. You guys do like the black? I don't like it with the gray stripes though. I kind of like it a little bit more with the white. Let's try the white stripes, not the band either. Let's try that. There we go. Now it kind of it kind of looks like a kind of looks like a uh, I don't know, just to me it seems like a police car. You know what I mean? Like it's got a you, you like this? This is good. Oh, you were dreaming about. Oh wow, Skittle says he was dreaming about this. Very nice. Okay, let's see what you guys think about the other colors. Uh, other people were saying like light gray. Ooh, that looks kind of cool. The math is weird. Ooh. It only looks good like with black though, I think. Oh, there you go. Ooh, that looks sweet. Though we kind of already have a blue car. Let's try green though. Let's try like a lime green. Mm. Ooh. Oh, that looks cool too. I like that. Ah, heck. What can What's not to like, folks? What's not to like? But anyway, I was liking the black, so let's just, just go with that. And guess what? If it ever, if we ever want to change it, we definitely can. So there you go. Matte black will go. We'll go with that then. And if we ever want to paint it, it's easy. You like the lime green? I did too. Okay, so here's our matte black. This is looking cool. Remember, pay no attention to the tires. Those were just to wheel it in here for now. But we'll go ahead and get ourselves some white wall tires to go along with this. That looks just fantastic. Look at that. That's really going to... Oh, man, that just looks really cool. It's going to look real nice. Okay, let's get her finished here. Let's roll her back onto the um, onto lift... Uh, I think it's lift 3 in this case. There we go, lifter C. Okay, so that was it for the paint job. That was pretty easy. We can try red. Well, yeah, we can try some other colors. We, we can uh, put it all together, and maybe we can paint it again, too. So let's try to get some more things in here. Um... Actually, maybe we'll, maybe we'll finish with that. Let's do an engine build now. What do you think, folks? Hey, by the way, a lot of new people watching right now. just want to remind you, folks, that if you hit that subscribe button, your name should pop up here in chat, and I will give you a big O shout-out. Also, if you haven't already, there's a free game waiting for you in the description. Check that first link in the description, and you guys can find it out here today. Go to the junkyard. We've already been there to get this one. Ooh, look at that. The tailgate opens up real nice, and look at that. That's real nice. Very cool. All right, let's go ahead and work on that engine, folks. Devin, thanks for subscribing. Now, I think we, we disassembled the engine. I think we repaired all the parts we could. Yep, so we got to go ahead and put it over here, back onto the, uh, onto the crane here and get everything reassembled. So the engine block for the 16, or the I-6, oh, I keep saying that, is uh, ready to rock. we got to get ourselves a new oil filter. Do tint. I don't think we can tint the windows. I, unfortunately, I don't think you can tint the windows. But uh, let's see here. Um, besides, why... Why would I want to tint the, wi tint the windows? Don't you want to see all this handsomeness in the, in the truck? What's up? Hi. I can wave at everybody. That'll be cool. Cool dude. Thanks for subscribing. 
Oh, did I forget the spring plate? Oh, we're not even we're not even close to being done with that. I just did that to get the tires in there. We'll get all of it together before we're done. Joseph, thanks for subscribing. Besides, it's time to work on that engine. All right, let's get that uh, assembled here. First of all, we need an oil filter. And uh, we may as well go on a filter buy here. Let's see, the I-6 is what we're looking for here. And we also need to buy an air filter. Hey, Blackside, everybody, thanks for subscribing. Welcome aboard, folks. I think we also need to have our... Uh, we need to buy a new air filter top as well. Bleach Man, welcome aboard. All right, let's get all the parts on here. We may as well throw the filter on there now as we're working on that. And uh, thermostat. Oh, I've never. Even, I don't even think I took one of those off. Linus, thanks for subscribing. Thermostat. Thermostat for a sick uh, eye. There we go. MLG, welcome everybody. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Good to have you here. I hope you folks enjoy your new free game in the description. Builder, welcome. All right, ignition distributor is up. Oh god! Oh boy! That's oh boy! Oh, I couldn't even spell that. Red Hood, welcome aboard. If you gotta go, you shouldn't say I gotta go 17 times. If you gotta go, then you just gotta go. Ethan, thanks for subscribing. I gotta go. I gotta go. I gotta go. I gotta go. I gotta. Now at that point, you're late. Now you're late. You don't gotta go. Now you're late. All right, let's get the. Uh, Ignition cap on, very good. I think we should flip this thing over. Let's let's go ahead and work on these parts instead. Crankshaft, you're going in. Camshaft, you're going in. Crankshaft bearing, you're going in. Welcome aboard to Cody Colbert. Thanks for subscribing. Welcome aboard, everybody. Put white walls on? Absolutely, that's what we're going to do, folks. we got to switch back and forth between, like, looking at the body, painting. we got to work back on the engine. There's so much to do. And, like, the cool thing about this game is that when you're bored of the engine, you're like, oh, I've had enough of that. You can step over and, like, assemble the body for a few minutes, and then you can come back over here. It's good. It adds variety. It's nice. It's I, I kind of feel that way when I do art. Like, when I do art, I, um... I basically like work on one spot, then I'm over here, then I'm down there. Uh, that's kind of how you do it. All right, let's do pistons now. Oh, wait, did I spell pistons wrong? Wait, pistons. What? P I S T O N. Oh, I was typing pistons as in like the item, but you have to spell it like as is. All right, so this is going to need an inline six, so we need six of these plus six piston rings. Five golden rings. That's a different thing. You guys let me? Well, I appreciate your support, folks. Thanks for all that. Appreciate that. All right, let's throw the piston with the Conrad on there. That is going to be time six on this one. Oh, boy. All right, uno, dos, tres, cuatro. Oh, 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 oh. that is a 96% piston. Why are we using the 96% pistons? I thought I bought, like, didn't I buy six 100% pistons? I thought I bought... Didn't I buy six pistons at 100%? Uh, we better go buy, like, a million more pistons or something. That was weird. Okay, let's uh, throw those in there, then. Ekavin, thanks for subscribing. And we'll, uh analyze this thing here in a second to make sure we got all the good pieces you guys love the videos well i love your support you guys keep saying that well thank you i appreciate that dearly thank you oh yeah everything's looking good all green all right we're good all right let's see the bearings are in so now we got to put on the uh what do they call it the um is it the con rod? oh the rod cap right all right there we go put a little cap on it got to keep it warm don't want to get cold happy bro thanks for subscribing you guys are great welcome all you new viewers, welcome aboard. What is the game? Uh, this game is uh, Barbie Turbo Corvette Builder 2019. Nah, I'm just teasing. It's uh, Car Mechanic Simulator. 2018! Ho, 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 ho. Don't want that on there. That's a bad one. Okay, let's get that rod cap on there. Very good. All right. And John, thank you for subscribing. So we do a lot of other games here, folks. We do play Farming Simulator. We do play uh, we play uh, Men of War. We play uh, Euro Truck and American Truck Simulator. So if you guys want to see more of that, hit that subscribe button, just like uh, Killer Fimmy did. And we're we're good to go there. Perfect. All right, we can flip this thing over. Cody, welcome aboard. 
Uh, how do we flip it now? Oh, right, we gotta back out, and we gotta select the, not the engine, but the crate. And there we go. Rotate, 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 and we're good. Dean, welcome aboard. What is the game in the description? That is Crossout. You guys can download that one now. It's only a couple of gigs, so uh, rather than me explaining it, why don't you go ahead? It's free of charge, so download it. If you like it, great. If not, you can always uninstall it. I own it. I played it. It's called Crossout. It's real good. You're subscribed and you clicked on the bell. Well, thank you very much. Again, if you folks want to support us via Super Chat, you can do so down below the little uh, square with the dollar sign in it. Click on that. You guys can go ahead and be king of the road tonight by supporting us via Super Chat. Right now, Waffle, by the way. A big O shout-out to Waffle again for his big O $5 support. So thank you for that. Tyler, thanks for subscribing as well. You guys are fantastic. All right, so this Ford is looking fantastic. This is a fantastical Ford right here. And we got to get another air filter on here. Uh, we got to get that reassembled, so the base has got to go back up. I tried to repair all these parts, so the ones that we're rebuying are just parts that wouldn't fully repair. So that's that. I'm liking this blue color. I don't know why it's blue. We can't repaint it or anything, though, so it is it is what it is, though. So there you go. All right. And again, to know when we're on Euro Truck 2, uh, make sure you're a subscriber, so that way uh, you'll find out when we're live or when we're playing it. Snow Shredder, welcome aboard. All right, let's go ahead and uh, get some more folks on here. Let's see. Boop. Ooh, we need some more. More, more, more. There we go. Water pump. All right, we're going to need to buy a new one of them. I love this truck. It's got so many custom pieces. And the other ones we did were V8, but this is an inline six, and this has got this has got power of its own. Mostly power of attorney, I believe. Maybe. I'm not sure. All right, let's get this water pump in here. Very good. There we go. All right. And Venom, thanks for subscribing. What is that brace called? What is that thing? Something arm? What was that? Arm B, okay. Does the car mechanic have a 70s challenger? It does have a challenger, though I don't know if it's 1970s specifically. People, there's a lot of debate around the years because there's a lot of detail missing to certain things, so I think they just try to make it as generic as possible just so people can try to have their favorites and pretend, I guess. Alternator is going on, then the fuel pump, uh, or the, the water pump pulley is going on. Sorry, not the fuel pump, water. Uh, let's see, water pump pulley is next. There we go. All right, and there we go. Oh, too bad we don't get to bolt that one on. Cam gear was in bad shape. Bad shape on the cam gear. Cam gear, 16, or the I IB. Oh, I'm always going to say 16. It always looks like a 16 to me. I'm just used to seeing one 6, that's all. All right, arm A for a I6B, and that's going to hold the, uh, wait. Oh, I didn't mean mean by that. Uh, oh, wait, arm A. Hey, Gabriel, thanks for subscribing. Welcome aboard. And we're going to throw that on here, too. Connell, thank you for subscribing. Welcome aboard, everybody. Thanks for subscribing. You guys are fantastic. All right, let's see. Yeah, if you guys subscribe but your name doesn't pop up, your subscriptions were set to private. Hayden, welcome aboard. Folks in chat, please remind everybody, too, of that if they ask. And my name didn't pop up. I know it's important for you guys to get your names up, but sometimes it just doesn't work. It's technology. Timing chain. All right, whoa, boy. we got to find our timing chain. Luckily, it's right here. Perfect. I'm odd. Thanks for subscribing. We haven't even been live an hour, and we're almost we're almost done with the engine. Let's let's try to let's try to do it. We're gonna try to do it. Timing cover. All right, we gotta get a new timing cover. All right, here we go. We're gonna try to speed it up here. Oh wait, there it is. Timing cover right here. Boom. All right, we're gonna we're going for speed strats right now, guys. We're gonna try to be aerodynamic gameplay right here on the channel. Oh boy. All right, better. Like I'm gonna hold my hair back now. Whoa, we're going so fast. Okay, good. All right. Well, that was that was the hard part. All right, crankshaft pulley. Oh boy. V V8. What? Why would it have a V8? Crankshaft pulley for a V8. Why would it? Why would it need that? It's not. It's not in line as six. Andrew, thanks for subscribing. But you see right there, it says V8. Okay, whatever you say, boss. All right, we need a couple of serpentine belts. Hold on a second. What do we need exactly? They're the serpentine belt A. All right, let's get those belts. <coughs> serpentine belt A for a 16B. Or an A. Oh my god, you guys know I'm going to keep making that mistake. Alright, and then B is the I. There we go. That's what we want. Alright, two of these. Hopefully we'll be good. Alright, here we go, folks. Now, don't go anywhere. We're about ready to finish this legendary Ford and bring her on a test drive. All we need to do here is wrap up the engine, 
put on a lot of the body uh, stuff. We need to get ourselves a radiator fan. Uh, fan B it is. Over to plan B at the radiator fan B. All right, there we go. All right, and again, folks, if you're new here, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Your name will pop up here in chat. I want to welcome you to our community, so hit that subscribe button so I can welcome you aboard to our family with the Ford. Yeah, I know. Worked well, didn't it? That's why I make the uh, moderate bucks. Okay, so let's go ahead and throw on the uh, flywheel. Oh, boy, we've got to buy ourselves a flywheel, the clutch release uh, flywheel. Let's get our flywheel going. Uriel, thank you for subscribing. Let's go ahead and get our clutch going, too. Clutch. I'm trying to build a Honda, yeah. Every time I say that. I know. I mean IB. Uh, let's see. Clutch release and... Oh, what was that other thing? The bearing, too. All right. It's better to just get these. All right, folks. We're coming up on 59 minutes. Oh, boy. Let's try to finish the engine before time. Oh, can we do it? Oh, one more thing. And we got it. All right. That's it. Ooh, it's all on there. Perfect. Okay, last piece is on there. I guess the clutch is really, truly the last piece. So th this is the... Uh, Oh, wait. Actually, that's done. There's nothing else we could do. Yeah. Oh, there is. Yeah, we'll just throw that on there. Perfect. All right. Welcome aboard, everybody. Okay. Now, the gearbox we can't put on until she's in the car, so that's it for that. Uh, zombie, thanks for subscribing. All right. Let's get this... Uh, let's get this in... Let's drop an engine in, folks. You ready for me to drop an engine? Let's do it. I know. We've been waiting all day. All right. Let's get this thing in here. Oh, actually, I think we have to... How do we do this now? We have to take this thing off here, don't we? How do we... I forget exactly how to do this. Um... I think we leave it on there, but then we drop it in, right? Install. Oh, no items. Okay, there's a way you have to take it off. Nicholas, thanks for subscribing. Actually, it's really weird. You have to, like, you, it vanishes into your pocket, and then you just carry... Yes, you carry an entire engine over to the engine crane, which, what's the purpose of the crane if you're that strong? And then drop her in. Perfect! Hey, hey, all right. Uh-oh, except for this menu in the way. There we go. All right, there she is. Very nice. Very, very good. All right, let's move that over to... Uh, Move that over to wherever. Oh, wait, not here. Uh, no, no, no. Darn it. I'm, I'm sorry. I'm getting so excited. All right, we're going to need this thing here. We're going to put put our engine back in as if nothing happened. Perfect. And then we'll just move this over to uh, some other area. A menu stuck up. It confused me. Confuzzled. All right, there we go. That's what we wanted. Very good. Okay, let's go ahead and get everything. We're going to install a few more things. We There's a few more things that we need to do. Now that she's in here, we can uh, mod We can put things on like the rocker arms and the, and the case and such. But now that we've dropped her in, we're all good. So spark plugs need to go in. A few other things that we still need to get. So let's go ahead and put those in there. It's nice to work on it when it's in the car now. I wanted to change the scenery. So spark plugs. Very good. All right, what do we need on these? Actually, I should, I, I should buy 100. You can never have enough spark plugs, to be honest. And folks saying, sub to me, sub to me, sub to me, please stop being so rude. I'm trying to entertain hundreds and hundreds of people watching me. If you would like to entertain people, too, instead of saying sub to me, just go live. Be uh, be brave. Make your first video. People will love it. Believe you me. So, uh, yeah, don't take away from our viewership here today. Just go ahead and make your own stuff. Be creative. That's a really good thing. All right, we're going to need a lot of these. Uh, oh, boy, these valve push rods are all going to be. Oh, man, you can never have enough of these things. You can never have enough push rods. Can never have enough push rods, and I think this is it right here. All right, we want uh, what are these? Uh, Twelve of these things. Oh, eh, well, I'm never going to use more than that. So there we go. Okay, let's go ahead and get uh, the rest of these on here. We're going to put our uh, push rods in here. Then we need to put on our. As you can see now, we're going to put rocker arms on, and then the cover will go on after that. So don't you worry. I just wanted to drop it into the car so we could work on it. And then we got to get some new tires, too. We're getting white walls so we can go over to the Sonic. Apparently, everyone wants to go over to Sonic, so we're, we're, we're heading out to the Sonic ASAP. You know how it is. You know, you just spend a couple hours rebuilding the entirety of your uh, Ford F100 in, and, and, you know, just an hour or two. That's all it really takes. So. Oh, lol. It is, it is awesome to play this game. Iceman, thank you for subscribing. Welcome aboard. And hello to FTG in chat. Hopefully, you're doing good. Thanks for tuning in and moderating my stream. By the way, FTG, I say you should go live soon because when I'm done, I can hand them over to you. Uh, we are Syndicate. Thank you for subscribing. How how did you get so many coins? Uh, I cashed in a dollar. Okay, let's continue on. Rocker arms going on there. Looks like we're going to need to buy a lot of those. Oh, boy. These rocker arms. They're the nightmare. All right, rocker arms. I wish we could have it like with the V8, except these have to be all one at a time. A lot of these boys to put on here. Ethan, thanks for subscribing. Yep, Dino Diner will come back soon, folks. Make sure you stay subscribed so you know when it goes live. I know I keep saying soon, but we're just waiting for the people to be available, that's all. And with it being the end of summer, people are taking a lot of vacations. Okay, let's finish this up here. We're going to go ahead and drop in the rest of these rocker arms. Then we're going to get that distributor cap on. We're going to throw this on. we got a few things to do underneath the car. And uh, 
Yeah, we've been jumping all over. It's an exciting day here as we're almost finished with this Ford. The engine is looking pretty sweet, actually. And it's very nice that we are nearing completion of our uh, Ford F100. Very nice. All right, now just a couple more uh, rocker arms to put in there. All the valves have been installed, and the cover should go on right after this. Very nice. All right, we should be able to put the cover on here. Let's see here. Actually, wait a minute. There we go. Distributor rotor and cap. Very good. And then the clips, too, right? And we need the wiring to go on, too. Clip B. And clip B there. Oh, also, guys, by the way, you can all support us via um, Twitter. You can follow me on Twitter, too. So hello, everyone in chat. Ultima Freak, thank you for subscribing. Hi, everyone. Good to see you all here. You missed a, a rod? Oh, yeah, we'll get that. Don't worry. I see it there. Yeah, I'll be missing a lot of stuff, so don't you worry. The nice thing about this game is if you do miss something, it will highlight it, and you won't miss it at all. So there you go. All right, let's get the uh, ignition wires on. Oh, we got to buy some ignition wires. All right, time to go make a purchase. Uh, I don't know when the game comes out for Xbox, so make sure that you, um, I guess, uh, make sure you check the Xbox store or Google. I actually, I just say Google it and uh, just see if you can add it to your Amazon wish list. Actually, that's a great idea. Add it to your Amazon wish list so that way when it becomes available, it'll notify you if, if it's a pre-order thing. You don't have to pre-order. Just, like, say, hey, I'm interested in this item, and then it'll pop up for you. All right, let's go uh, cover. What do we want here? Undercover? No, we want a uh, engine head cover. Oh, well, that's what I wanted. Very good. All right. Okay, there we go. Engine uh, cover. There we go. Boom, boom, boom. Wow, a lot of uh, bolts on this one. Oh, my goodness. All right. Well, welcome aboard, everybody. Nice to have you all here today. Again, if you haven't already, go ahead and hit that subscribe button, and your name will pop up here in chat. Welcome, everybody. Nice to have you all here. We, we've got a great chat tonight, guys. You're, be, you're being a fantastic chat, so thank you very much for that. All right, I think we're pretty solid on the engine, are we not? We've just got to drop a battery in. We've got to drop a... Uh, oh, it looks like it's at 89%. I think we can use... Actually, I've never used the battery charger before. How does that work? Charge battery. Oh, you can. that's all you have to do? Oh, wait, look at it go. Oh, it's doing magic. Wow, there's a battery being charged. Does this take a while? Oh, it's in, in, instant. Is it instant? Wait a minute. All right, let's go ahead and take a look here at assemble mode. Wait, I'm just going to check. Oop, music cut out here for a second. Uh, let's see here. Do, 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 do. Okay, let's roll. There we go. All right, now back to the uh, car we go. If you roll downhill, you don't need an engine. That is facts brought to you by Whiskey, guys. He's full He's full of facts. And probably also uh, a delicious, like, uh, rice, broccoli thing that his wife makes. I hear it's good. That's why I married her. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. What's up with this radiator sea cap? Whoa, 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 whoa. Radiator sea cap. Excuse me, but uh, you can't be in there. What happened to our cooling? Is that... Wait, why is this thing not 100%? It says it's 100%. Why is the cap so gross? That's weird. Let's just buy a new one. Just because I think it might be glitched. Let's buy Radiator C, and we'll just install a new one. You guys subscribed? Wonderful. Thank you for your support. Can you build a monster truck? Not at the moment, but that would be... You know what I really want to see is just Diesel Mechanic Simulator. Just give, just give us a diesel. Why can't I buy a Radiator C cap? It won't even let me pull the cap off. Why are you doing this? Game, why, why are you doing this? Old left to take out part. Oh, you can take it off. Good. Hey, cool catcher. Hey, hey, hey. Truck's looking amazing. Absolutely. And your support is amazing as well. Cool. So a big O. Circle 7 salute everybody in chat for our friend cool catcher. Go ahead and type Circle 7. That's our salute for all of our big supporters. Here comes that rocket strike. Beautiful. Oh, there's the radiator cap. All right. Thank you very much for that. Oh, and apparently it's free. All right. Hot deals here. And uh, thanks again to Waffle and Cool Catcher for their big O support here. All right, I thought it was I thought it was possibly glitching out, so you never know with this game sometimes. Uh, let's see, made home cooked potatoes and grilled pork tenderloin. Very nice, very very nice. You eat like kings over at that house. All right, let's see, uh, what else do we need to throw in here? Looks like we need to lift her up now and uh, start working on the suspension, the gearbox, and a few other things. Hey, that black and blue looks real cool. I like that. That's really solid. That's a really nice. Uh, turned out real well. All right, let's lift her up. The tires, of course, are coming off. We do not like those tires at all. They're, we just uh, use those tires to roll her into the, into the uh, paint shop. So we're going to get our tires off here. Let's do some tires. We need some white walls. All right, let's get uh, new rims, new tires. Maybe, actually, maybe we can repair the rim. That might be a good way to save some cash. 
So off comes the tires of this Ford F100, a legend, an absolute gorgeous, uh, just man, just what a truck. Um, this is the type of truck that uh, if you ever if you ever see the uh, you know car and driver calendars, you know this is like Buddy McKenzie's uh, you know 19 something Ford whatever. It's on uh, you know well, the, I, I was uh, I was I was March of 99. I also made the calendar in 02 and 07. It's like wow, truck owners are awesome. All right, Dallas, thanks for subscribing. You want me to make the back tires a little bigger? I think we're just going to white wall this one out and just make it generic. We got to go to Sonic, so we don't want to we don't want to look too intimidating. I mean, how else are we going to get all of those uh, tater tots into the back? That's why we're using a pickup truck. All right. Uh let's see. Yes. Time for um I don't know if I like the rims though. Do the the classic rims looked okay, didn't they? 1960 Ford F100 says Christy. Could be. I'm not sure. You could be right. Let's take a look at rims. Time to do some rims, y'all. They need to add Cummings engines. I agree. I want to see some more engines in this. White wall, absolutely cool. We're doing that for sure. All right, folks, it is time for us to pick rims. And uh, boy, oh boy, we've got a lot to pick from. And I don't think we want to do anything too fancy with this. We, we don't want any of the attention to be on the tires. They should be all on the car. Hmm. We've used these before, I think. And these. I want something dark. Are these nice? What, do you guys think this would be okay? What do you guys think about that? That looks nice, right? Is that is that pretty... It looks nice? Jalin, thank you for subscribing. Again, remember, we're black and white, so the darker interior with the uh, the lip might... It might look good. No spoilers? Oh, there, yeah, no spoiler alerts. What do we think, Chad? Does everyone like this? What do you guys think? Go with the solid rims. What are the what are the solid rims? People are saying yes. Is this good? I don't know. No? It's like fifty I feel like it's fifty fifty. Alright, hold on. Let's go with Whiskey was saying something about uh what is he saying? Solid rims? I don't I don't think they're solid. People were saying yes, but I I don't know. We can look around. Ooh. No, that's too much. That's too much. I don't know. The retro C. It's like it was meant to be, I think. All right, let's go with this. And do we want 16-inch? Retro 9. What's retro 9? Somebody's saying retro 9. We may have done that one before. That sounds familiar. Retro 9. Down here? Oh, that's 10B. Oh, retro 9. Uh, I don't know. I like, I like the dark. I don't know. Eh, let's just give it a try. We're uh, we got an unlimited budget anyway, so if it if it stinks, we can always just replace it. Okay, the the purchase uh, has been complete. We're gonna just go with 16 inch. We're not we're not doing any sort of racing or any crazy stuff. So uh, I think we should go with the uh, we went with the C wall before the B. Hmm. Do you think B would be okay? Well, that's an awful. That's a pretty big. That's that's a lot of that's a lot of wall. And again, folks, uh, anybody saying come check out my channel or sub to me or anything like that, the moderators will time you out. We're trying to entertain a lot of people here uh, today uh, who want to be entertained by playing uh, Car Mechanic Simulator. Uh, we don't come to your channel and advertise, so please don't do it here. It's just a, just a courtesy. But if you want to work with me, if you want to come on to the team speak, you're all welcome. And by the way, you're welcome to download a free game. Whoa! He said free. Yes, I did. The first link in the description, folks, is waiting for you. The first one. Yeah, check it out. First link. There's a free game waiting for you. All right, everyone, you guys like this? Okay, let's just let's just go with this, and we'll buy four of these, and we'll just throw it on. I mean, again, we're trying to look for cool. Get, see, whiskey says thin, but I don't know because we got a we got an awfully big rim. Josh, thanks for subscribing. He could be right though. I think we already have thin wall on there though. I don't know. All right, guys, I need to know. Everybody in chat, by the way, everybody in chat, um, I need to know thin. All right, are we going A, A or B? Everybody in chat right now, we need to start blowing it up with A or B, folks. A or B, A or B, guys. A or B. Are we going A or B? Oh, you guys are you guys are being stupid. Don't do that in chat. I told you not to do that. Now the now the nightbot's timing a lot of you out for saying sup to me. Don't be that way. A or B, folks. I need to know A or B, A or B. No, it seems like it's split 50-50 again. I'm not even sure. I think I'm seeing just a little bit more Bs, so we'll go with B. All right. 
Let's throw these on here. We're going to go over to the uh, tire. Uh, what is it called? They call it the separator, but or, or changer, right? Uh, so this is what our old rim used to be. And the, the new rim looks the same. It's just a black rim. Yeah, that looks fine. Oh, yeah, that looks really nice. I think that looks good. I think we might have this here. Let's take a look. Oh, that looks nice. Oh, actually, that looks really sweet. Well, that, that actually might be a winner. Although, those old rims, I don't know. The old rims could have... Oh, I don't know. I, I don't know. The, yeah, they had the smaller wall on them. I don't know. You know what the cool thing is? is we can keep them both, though. So anytime we want to change the tires, tire change is the easiest thing to do. Glenn, thanks for subscribing. The hardest thing is being like, hey, yeah, let's change the color. you got to rip everything off and roll it right into the, right into the paint shop. Tell them to play RoboCraft. Oh, boy. All right, I'll, I'll let them know. Okay, let's see. Uh, install. Retro. Wall B. There we go. Grab the tire balancer. All right, now we don't know for sure, folks, unless unless we put the tires on, we just won't know whether or not it's truly nice. So let's just go ahead and throw a tire on. Let's just see how it looks. Let's just we're just we're just taking a look. We're just looking. We're not buying. Redneck Studios, thanks for subscribing. Hey Jack Worrell, thanks for telling people to sub. Yeah, if you guys are liking what you're seeing, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Oh my god, that tire is pathetically small. Oh my god. <laughs> look at how tiny that is. That is so oh my god. Alright, we definitely need to buy a uh, good rim, bad tire. Good rim, bad tire. Uh, well, good tire, but not not the right size. So luckily, we've got an unlimited budget, and also we can always use more of these. Uh, you know, we can always use these on a different uh, on a different uh, <laughs> higher profile. Yeah, we're gonna do that. All right, let's go for. Uh, what's a good profile? Should we like double it to like? I think we should double it. What about seventy five? Do you think that'd be better? Let's go with one seventy five and let's see what happens. Let's let's buy one of those and throw it on there. Uh, let's go with one of these with the seven tier with the uh, this is the 75 oh that looks better maybe two two five seven five hmm Jeez, the tire the tires are always the hardest part for me because I can never I never know until I actually have it on the rack you know Oh, wait, let's make sure we're picking the right tire. Uh, let's see, that's the 45. This is the 75 here. All right, let's throw that on there. Well, now that's looking a lot nicer. That that might work. That might work. Hi, everyone. Good to see you all. If you haven't already, hit that subscribe button. Go ahead and do so. Your name will pop up. I want to give some shout-outs here today. Thanks, folks, for tuning in. This is good. This is very good. By the way, <clears throat> yeah, a lot of you are saying 22575, so if we need to, we'll, we'll go for that. But again, we're just trying to make it look pretty for now. So all we're going for is prettiness. All we're doing is we're rolling over to the Sonic. So we can always come back and change those tires. Let's go ahead and throw a tire on again. Now, last time it was a little too small. This time with the uh, 75 rating. Oh, this might be a little better. All right, let's see here. Better, but not quite. So you guys might be right. All right, Raptor has a lot to learn about tires. But good thing... I looked and didn't do all four tires. Yeah, isn't the, isn't the truck beautiful? Regardless of the tires, that is just... That that right there was the correct move, I think. MBS, thanks for subscribing. All right, let's go ahead and uh, we're going to go ahead and do this here. Uh, we're going to grab ourselves... Uh, so, chat's saying 225... Oh, wait, 22575. That looked like the right profile to me. Or do we want... Do we, or do we want bigger? Yeah, we're getting a lot of deleted messages because people in chat are just being rude and they're just not listening to our request to just not advertise their channels. They're trying to be tee-hee funny, but don't do that, guys. Otherwise, um, you know, otherwise you're going to get in trouble. Don't do that. All right, let's go ahead and uh, continue on here. we got all the tires we need. Oh, wait a minute. we got to install some tires here. I want to know, everybody, by the way, if, uh, if you could paint this truck any color, what color would it be? What color are you guys going to go with? I, I need to know. We went with a matte black. What color truck would you choose? Which color would you like? Would you pick the yellow, the orange, the green? Would you go with uh, racing stripes or not? Or would you put your own custom logo on there? Do you have your own custom logo? Maybe. All right, we're going to go with these 85s. I don't know. We need we need big, big, big tires on this one then. Oh, that, that looks perfect right there. That's about what I wanted it to be. Nicholas, thanks for subscribing. Baby blue, that is a good color. I think we tried baby blue, and it was awesome. 
I just wanted to go with black because it was just a little tiny bit better. Okay, we're going to go with that one then. We're going to take the uh, other... Wow, those actually look way... <laughs> that is so much white wall. Holy crap. That is so much white wall you can actually hang family photos on it. I'm, I'm serious. Speaking of white walls, look what's hanging on mine. Yeah, YouTube uh, 100,000 uh, sub button. Thank you, everyone, for helping me to get there, by the way. So I appreciate everyone subscribing and such. I don't often say it, but thank you, everyone, for being a subscriber. Thank you for all your super chats and all that stuff. Keegan, thank you very much for helping us to get one more to a billion subs. Now, most YouTubers go for maybe a million, but we're going for a billion. It's going to be big-o. All right, we got to separate the other tires here, unfortunately, so it's going to take us a minute or two. So while that's separating, we're going to grab this tire here, throw her on. Uh, it doesn't matter. It's good. It's a lot of wall, but, uh, man, it's going to be awesome. So much wall, we might, we might have to have a painter come out. All right, let's see here. Oh, my God, that is so much white wall. Oh, but that is sweet. I think this is going to look good. I think this might be okay. Though, whisk, uh, I don't know, maybe we should have went with the, maybe the C's would have been a little bit better. The A, I think, maybe would, would have been too thin. Maybe he was right with the A. I don't know. But man, those white walls are sweet. That is absolutely sweet. Why don't they have white walls anymore? They need everybody. Every car needs white wall. Oh, you, matte pink. Oh, that's a good idea. That might look good. Barbie would love that, and so would I. All right, let's go ahead and go with this one now. We got to throw. We got to pull some of these rims off here of our experiments, our failed experiments from before. Uh, you have to buy Teamspeak. Use Discord. It's free. Actually, Teamspeak's free. If you check the last uh, link in the description, you guys can join our Teamspeak. Teamspeak's ab it's absolutely free, and all the YouTubers use Teamspeak. By the way, they do because it has a higher radio, uh, higher uh, s sort of quality that allows uh, for better recordings and such. Uh, tw uh, it doesn't offer that on Discord. So yeah, get yourself onto our Teamspeak and come say hi, folks. Bigger size? I don't think we can go any... Uh, we can't go any bigger. Th that, that's enough right there. That's enough rim. That's that's all good. Oh, boy. It's actually almost touching the inside of the truck. Eh, who cares? It's all right. Tires are never going to be perfect. I'm getting tired of it anyway. You're in the team speak? Good. Thank you for joining our team speak. Again, you guys can come say hi, and if we do future Euro Truck or uh, American Truck Convoy live streams, you can join us there. Shay, thanks for subscribing. All right, pull another one off here. I feel like we're missing a rim and tire. We are, aren't we? Because the game sometimes likes to eat your ti uh, your tires for whatever reason. I don't know why. Oh my god, look at the difference in those tires. Holy crap. That is incredible. Alright, let's change. We're, we're going to be short one tire because the game gobbles up tires and rims, I think. Actually, it gobbled up a tire, I think. Wait, is it? Wait, whoa, whoa, that's not even the right one? Oh my god. All right, uh, let's just go ahead and buy a bunch of those tires again because I don't know what it did with the tires, but I feel like it's just gobbling up tires. So let's go with the 225. What do we go? I think we went with the 80. Because, or, did I go 85? I did, didn't I? All right, we're just buying four of these again because the game keeps gobbling up our tires. And, uh, by the way, nothing beats this. Not even Amazon Prime because uh, it, it's delivered instantaneously. All right, and then where were those rims again? It's here, Retro 3. So let's buy it. Let's just buy two of these. Just, nah, let's just buy all four. Because I feel like the game's just going to gobble up the rest of my rims like they did before. All right, let's go ahead and grab this. Separate parts. We're going to go ahead and, let's see, this is the 85. That's the 45 there. That's got to be pulled off. And this should be the correct rim. I'm not sure. We'll, we'll see here in a second. It was 75? Are you sure? I thought we went 85. I think I went a little bit bigger because I wasn't sure. I think we went 85. But whatever. I won't tell if you don't. No, they look the same. I think it is 85. Let's check this one. Oh, you can't even... Oh, you... oh it doesn't even tell you. Oh, the road tester. Wait a minute. Let's try that. Uh, where's the... What the... F How am I supposed to use this? Oh. Oh, it's... T what, what is it doing? Oh, it doesn't even tell... Oh. It doesn't even tell you. You have to, like, pull it off. That's dumb. All right. Let's figure this out here. Again, if you guys want a shout-out, hit that subscribe button. If you guys want a shout-out, go ahead and support us via Super Chat. Dino Hunter 55 oh My God, you better not be coming for me. I'm on the run. I think it is these 85s. This is perfect. This is what we're looking for. All right. Two more to install, then. All right, look at that. Oh, man, this is almost done, folks. She's looking good. Less wall, bigger rim. Oh, I don't know. I, li I like the wall. I like the wall. What can I say? It looks nice. But you know what? The nice thing about the tires, we can change them anytime. Easy peasy. 
All right, and we want this last one to be 225 with the 85. Is that right? Yes. All right, so we're going to balance. Yeah, these rims look great. Also, the regular, uh, the other chrome rims would look just fine, too. I guess with the, you know what, to be honest, with tires and rims, there's just no wrong answers. I think so many different rims and tires look great. Like, look at, for example, on our, our, our uh, Mustang here. We've got uh, Dominator slick uh, tires on that one. Over here, we got uh, white walls on this one, too. Looked, looks pretty good. It all turned out great. So, I mean, there's really... And the nice thing is, you can just flip them over anytime. It's not, not a problem. All right, let's get these tires on here. Let's go ahead and balance. We're going to get our uh, final two tires installed, and that should be good, aside from body work. We then need to figure out the interior and a few more things on the body, such as the, uh, the mirrors and... Uh, what's the other thing? Um, mirrors and, I think, windows. Yes. All right, there we go. Okay, one more tire to go, folks. Man, those look like huge donuts. Maybe it'll distract the cops with the yellow, uh, with the white and the black and the whole donut thing. And who doesn't like donuts? And I love donuts. Today's stream brought to you by donuts, guys. Yeah. All right, let's see. Uh, we're going to go ahead and throw this down here. Let's go ahead and throw this last one in. There we go. Boom. Oh, I did it wrong. Eh, whatever. It's okay. Don't worry. Only I know. And you guys, too. Actually, everybody everybody knows. All right. There she is, folks. Now, that is nice. That is just... That is that is just... Oh, my God. I'm just... I'm not crying. There's something in my... <clears throat> okay. All right. All right. Let's get it back up there, because we do need to do some work on the suspension. But, man, oh, man, does that look pretty. Yes, I do check the chat. That is right. Not all the time, though. There's a lot of messages and a lot of people. So how about I just say hi to everyone, and you say hi to me. Hi, everyone. Hello. Hi there, Neil Bridges. Thanks for subscribing. Hi there, Carl. Cool catcher. Uh, Darquan and Merp. Hello, everyone. Good to see you all here. All right, let's go ahead and get the rest of this stuff in here. Where, what are we missing? Oh, yes, the plates underneath the uh, leaf springs. There we go. And we'll get those on there. We'll get this thing a little test drive here in a moment. Uh-oh. Real far away from this thing. There we go. Zoom in on it. There we go. Perfect. Now we get that dramatic zoom. Dun, dun, dun. All right, two more springs to put in. Or actually, uh, two. well, two more on this side. There we go. Luis, thanks for subscribing. All right, we'll get those U bolts in. U U U bolts makes me think of U banks, as in Kevin U banks and the Tonight Show band from uh, Leno. Kevin U banks is cool. Good. Uh, I think he was a bassist or lead guitar. I'm not sure. All right, rubber bushings need to go in. All right, we were in such a hurry to get those wheels on that I just skipped past a few things. All right, perfect. Now, there's absolutely nothing else that has to be connected in order to get this vehicle to work, folks. In fact, just magic is going to teleport the power from the front to the back drivetrain. Thailand, thanks for subscribing. All right, let's go ahead and get the gearbox on here. Oh, boy, that's a gross gearbox. Let's get a new one on here. Gearbox, that is a great, that is a great guy name for, like... Like, if you have a g group of friends that goes by a nickname, that would be a great uh, name for a guy who is, like, into cars. You can just call him Gearbox. Like, oh, here comes Gearbox. Hey, what's up, guys? You love the streams? Well, I love your support, Wolf. Thanks for being a positive member of our chat. Welcome aboard. Sub to Raptor, the truck is beautiful as is. Yes, it is. You mean the truck or me? Because I don't... I mean, Jack, if you're saying I'm beautiful, I appreciate that. That's very kind. Thank you. But you're beautiful, too. So thanks for being awesome, you guys. All right, let's get this last thing in here. We need to get that darn drivetrain up there. Let's go, baby. Why can't I put it up there, though? Hmm. There seems to be something missing that I'm doing. Oh, there it goes. Drive shaft. Yeah, for whatever reason, it wouldn't like let me put it in. Yeah, there it goes. Boom. You hate Fords? Oh, this is such a classic truck, though. You can't just hate on the Fords. This is a, this is a classic. It earned your respect. And I must say that even if you're like a Chevy guy or who, no matter who you root for, there. Look at the beautiful. I mean, look at this. You got Fords sitting right here. That's gorgeous. You got Dodge over here. Absolutely beautiful. You got the Trans Am sitting back here. Probably seen better days, but we'll, we'll make her look beautiful again soon. We got a Shelby around here, too. You guys know Shelby. Man, just gorgeous. First time I ever heard about, like, 90% of the cars in my life, Gran Turismo. Gran Turismo has shown me so many awesome cars, both classic and modern day. Just awesome. Like, you, you, you didn't see all the cars in the world, but when you played a video game, boom, every car ever. You'd be like, oh, wow, they made, like, four... Like, you, you see Fords nowadays, and you think, oh, these must be the only cars they've ever made. And then you realize, wait a minute, Ford used to make this, Ford used to make that, Dodge used to make this. You look, you look at, like, the uh, modern uh, Dodge Nitro, and you think to yourself, 
Hmm. Hmm. All right, let's go ahead and uh, I guess we can drop her down. Did we did we get everything into the other s underside? I think so. I'm sure I missed something, so we'll come back to it if I did. All right, the underside is done. Let's go ahead and uh, figure out the body and a few uh, remaining parts on the engine, and let's whip her out for a test drive. Chevy for life? Okay, yeah. Yeah, you can you can love Chevy all you want. You can love Ford all you want. But regardless, it's good to have uh, two competing companies competing, competitive companies, because if they didn't compete, then they wouldn't be trying to battle for your dollar, and if they didn't battle for your dollar, technology would have never gotten better. Okay, well, she's looking good. The engines are on, the brakes are on. The uh, I think we just need to work on the body, so let's do it. Um, let's see. Um, okay, I think what we're going to do is we're going to work on we're going to work on the exterior first. So the only thing we need from the exterior are the mirrors and the um, yeah we need the mirrors. Oh, headlights. I'm just going to go ahead and buy all new parts for the headlights and for the tail lights. So we want the side mirrors. Uh, tail lights. Oh, you know what? Bumpers, too. So we're going to buy a new chrome bumper. And front bumper. Beautiful. Okay, everything's looking good. Alright, so let's go ahead and... Well, now, come on, cooperate with me. There we go, assemble mode. Perfect. Alright, front bumper, you're going on. Left headlight, you're going on. Oh, we need to get ourselves a custom light. Oh, this one's from Finland. Cool. Or at least it popped up as Finland. All right, folks, I want to know where everybody's watching from tonight. I might pick the uh, state or the country that you're in tonight. So uh, one that piques my interest is going to get custom license plates tonight. So let me know where you're watching from. And I'm going to try to get a custom license plate from where you're from. So let me know where you're watching from tonight. All right, now let's see. A couple extra things we need to do are the windows. So we need to get the rear and side windows, and then we're going we're gonna to buy ourselves a license plate. So you got a couple seconds left, folks, to let me know where you're from. And I think we need the rear window, which is down here. Very good. Okay, let's see. Rear window. Boom. Left window. Boom. Right window. Boom. In the front. Okay, that's it. Now let's sit in it for a second. I think we can... Oh, it doesn't let us open it. Uh, I think we can put it back there now that it's done. Let's go ahead and lower it down. Oh, actually, you know what? We still need to put the interior into it, but in order to do that, let's move it over here. All right, we're almost done, folks. Keep letting me know where you're from. Ohio, Michigan, Nebraska. What other What other countries? Canada? All right, nice. South Dakota, very good. Guyana, very cool. Estonia, Denmark, Belgium. Oh, Sweden. Hey, how I do? All right, let's see here. Uh, how do we move this thing? Oh, yes, let's move it to a parking spot. Ah, oh, crap. I didn't mean to move it. Uh, I meant for it to park over here and not actually go to the parking garage. Now we got to go track it down to the parking garage. Great. All right, well, we'll go take a look at the rest of the cars that we have to offer. So, again, folks, if you're new around these parts, go ahead and hit that subscribe button so that way you don't miss out on when we do these other cars here. There's so much to do in Car Mechanic Simulator 2018, and I just want to show you guys the rest of what we've got planned for you coming up very soon. And these are all here at our magical parking garage, so long as it loads here. There we go. And uh, we got a lot more work to do, so we've got ourselves a Corvette to work on, a couple of luxury vehicles. We do have uh, Challengers to work on and of course the Shelby as well that is one dirty dirty beast over there ooh actually this one even better wait where'd our where'd our car go then uh, oh it's over here oh cool we got additional parking spots ah right, very nice we've got our uh, Daytona over here ready to go and of course our uh, b beautiful beast right over here we still need to put a couple of things on her but we'll be working on that Shelby sometime soon alright what do we see here uh, Texas Canada Texas Texas looks like a lot of Texas here I, I think Texas might win folks tell me where you're from I wanna see a lot of people saying where they're from whoever the most uh, wherever I see the most amount of people from that's what we're gonna do tonight so uh, let's go ahead and see if we can bring this one back to the garage and uh, wow we can get like this one for forty thousand oh my goodness alright let's go back to the garage and let's put the f finishing touches on this things Minnesota, Wisconsin, Quebecois, Canada, Scotland. Oh, I see a lot of Texas. Texas, Texas is taking over tonight, baby. Fuzzy, thanks for subscribing. Belgium, Mexico, Argent. Is that Argent? Oh, An Antarctica. Oh, I, saw I thought I saw Argentina. Uh, Canada. All right, I think it's between Canada and Texas. They're having a battle tonight, guys. Uh, Ohio. Oh, tech I think Texas is going to take it home. All right, now let's not make this mistake again. Let's try to put this thing into the right spot. We want it at the garage entrance. There you go. That's what I was looking for. All right, we still need a few things to do before we put the custom license plates on. We do need to add two seats to the interior, and we need to uh, put on a cool steering wheel. 
So we're about to uh, add a few things to that. Man, look at that shifter, baby. Nolan, thanks for subscribing. All right, let's go ahead and get our interior popping here, interior shop. And let's go with uh, some cool seats for this thing. we got to go classic with this one. Lance, thanks for subscribing. Not any of this high-tech race stuff. Um, well, let's pick a steering wheel first of all. I'm liking that one. Hmm. Wood definitely seems right in this car. Yeah, let's go with this one. Canada, it's it's like Canada versus Texas. All right, everyone in chat, vote. Who do you like more? Do you like te Big O Texas with the steaks, or do you like Canada, where Terrence and Philip are from, and also where they have delicious syrup? And Ed Eddington Mall is up there. It's Jack YouTube. Thanks for subscribing. Again, Texas with the steers and the big O countryside and the you know all the lovely country music and the big ranches. Or do you like Canada with the snow and the uh, and they also have some very good cheese. And of course, they also speak French and English in Canada. So you get to you get to pick either language. Canada or Texas, folks? Who's going to win? Oh, I think Texas is winning. All right, Canada, I love you, but Texas, I think, is taking the cake today. Uh, or, or actually, funnel cake. There you go. That's more of a Texas thing, isn't it? All right, let's pick our seats then. Now, since the uh, Texans won, let's go with the uh, seat that the Canadians might like. And I don't, I don't know what that means at all, but I'm going to try to like think like a Canadian right now. Uh, let's see. That's Oh, wow, they have ones for the Challenger. Wait a minute. Do they have ones f specifically for the Smith? Oh, they don't. Okay, so we can pick any, we can pick any seat that we want, I think, for this uh, car. So long as it lets me pick. There we go. All right, so we need to pick two seats. We need to go very Canada right now. Dr. Hemi, thanks for subscribing. That is a great name. Dr. Hemi, welcome aboard. Nice to have you here. All right. Let's see. What seems like Canada? Oh, my God. Look at that one. That one's called the Reptilia. These are way too race car-like, though. I want something classic. Oh, but we got to go something like black and white, though. Like seat one leather. Ooh. Eh, I don't know. Four hundred dollars for these. That looks a little bit. That looks more correct. I don't know. It still looks a little. Draco, thanks for subscribing. Hey, I'm going good. I think Texas won that war tonight, folks. But don't worry. That means Canada gets the Shelby. Then I think. All right. Let's see. Seat leather. That looks nice. I like. I, it's a deep dark color. Oh, but this one is too. Oh, you know what? This one's actually got the same color scheme going on. Is there something that's like black and white? Because we're going with that. If it doesn't... Yeah, it looks like this one's going to win. Um, but this one looks a little less aggressive. The other one's like... The other ones like look like they're flexing. Like, come on! And it's like, you're just a seat. You need to relax, seat. And it's like, no, I need. we need to go... Pamela, thanks for subscribing. All right, look. That looks great. Let's go ahead and throw some seats in then. Uh, normal mode. Oh, we can uh, put a seat in here. Oh, right. The, uh, uh, the side view mirrors. Let's put that on. All right, assemble mode. Oh, there we go. I forgot it's on the doors. I have one eye. Thanks for subscribing. Okay, let's see. We need the other side view mirror on. Perfect. Beautiful baby. Now, the interior is the next thing to go on. And let's go with the uh, interior disassemble. And then we'll switch to interior assemble. Beautiful. Yeah. Oh, I see. They kind of went with those seats. Oh, like they went that. Nah. Now, let's take a look at this. Oh, that looks nice. That That is beautiful right there, baby. That's 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 absolutely incredible. Look at that, folks. That's nice. The wooden classic touch to that. You guys want to sit inside? Sh should we should we take a seat? Let, let's take a seat. How do we uh, There we go. Let's sit down. Oh my goodness, that is it. Hold on. Let's let's step out for a second and shut the uh let's shut the uh There we go. Very nice. Killer. Thanks for subscribing. Chain wheel? Oh no 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 not not in this one. That 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 looks great. That is beautiful. I think that's perfect right there. The uh, interior seats look really nice. It matches all the theme. The white walls uh, match the uh, match the paint, which matches the tires. And then of course just a little bit of classic uh, touch here. Really nice. All right, can we start it up? Should we start it up? Let's. How do we? Uh, is there a way to just start it? Oh. Oh my God. You guys ready? All right, here we go. And she did. <laughs> She's not starting. That means we're missing something. Oh boy. What are we missing? Hmm. Oh, you know what? I know what we're missing. Do you guys know what we're missing? I know what we're missing. We're missing the oil. Yeah, alright. Let's put it in. 
Can't start it without the oil. And that should be just enough right there. Very good. Oh, the starter? Well, there's no starter though. We're uh, missing. Uh, we were missing one part, I think. All right, let's try this again. Oh, well, she's not going either. Fluid. We did the oil. Hmm. I don't think. It's not like we're mit. Well, would you imagine that? No wonder she won't start because there's no starter. Oh, just like you guys said. I didn't see it. You know what? That slipped my mind because when we took the engine apart, it wasn't. It wasn't a part of the engine, so we got to buy one. Oh no, battery. It is the starter. Oh, she won't start because there's no starter. Imagine that. Well, that would make sense. All right, now it's a starter for a regular car, so we should be good. Radiator fluid. I think we got to check the blinker fluid too. I gotta get. I gotta check that out. Luckily, we can just l lay under the car and pop that one back in. Very good. All right. <sighs> okay, we should be good. All right. Oh, and then we'll get we'll get our custom license plates as soon as she starts. So Texas, stick around. Yeah. Can we rev? Can we rev? Oh, we can't rev. Darn. Very good. Thanks, Cool Catcher. You're great, man. All right, time for those custom Texas license plates. Let's get those purchased as well. And then we're going to take her out on the road for a little bit of a test drive. All right, let's go ahead and grab our custom license plates. And let's do Texas. T-E-X-A-S. All right, there we go. Texas truck. Oh, it says Texas truck. Yes, it is. It sure is. All right, now let's see. Before, we've gone with a couple of creative names before. Now, what do we what do we call this? Wait a minute. There we go. Tex Rex. How about that one? Similar to dinosaurs, it works. Okay, perfect. Now let's go ahead and put on our assemble mode there. We're going to put on our Texas license plate. Tex Rex right there. Very good. So Texas front and back. I don't think that's a Tex. I don't think I've ever seen a Texas license plate, but is that is that a Texas license plate? That doesn't seem right. Is this for like semi trucks? Is that is that a Texas license plate? That just doesn't seem like is that is that right? I don't Maybe I maybe I'm just thinking of like old Texas license plates. Yeah, I don't know. I typed in Texas. Maybe it's like a custom plate or something. Let's see what else they got. Was there any other Texas license plates? Go to all. There we go. Where's Texas? Pennsylvania. There. Ukraine. Oh, they have the Ukraine? No way. Wisconsin, Wyoming, beautiful. Virginia. Rhode Island, Ohio. Very nice. No, they're not. Yeah, see, they didn't look like Texas to me either. I guess they're just custom. So some sort of a custom plate. Maybe it's a colla uh, I don't know. Who knows? All right. Now, here, here we go, folks. What we need to do is we need to roll this one out to the, um, we need to roll this one out to the, uh, to the test track. So you guys ready? We're going out. We're heading out to the uh, we're going out out to the tech tra uh, test track right now. So we're gonna roll out and uh, we're gonna start uh, testing this one out. See what we can do here. And uh, let's see, Darian, try to try a little bit harder, sweetie. Try to be a little bit more edgy somewhere else. All right, let's start her up and let's roll out. All right, we're going to the test track then. Oh yeah. Wait, can I go to the? Oh, I want to go to the race track. All right, well we're gonna have to go to the uh, test track then. Yeah! Alright, we're going to give this one a test drive, folks, and then we're all good to go. So if you guys enjoyed tonight's show, make sure you hit that subscribe button. Don't go anywhere. We're not done yet. Free game waiting for you all in the description. And um, we're going to give this one a test drive here in a second or two. So again, guys, if you haven't already, hit that subscribe button. I want to give everyone a big old shout out here. Now is the perfect time as we're about ready to test out this awesome Ford F100 beautiful absolutely gorgeous if you haven't already go ahead and hit that like button and let me know you want to see more of this game and that's a great way to say yeah i like this i want to see more i want to know what you do next also if you haven't already you can also download cross out in the description the first link in the description folks it is nice to have you all with us and uh, in watching so uh let's see tony lie thank you very much for subscribing here comes all the subs folks and again look down look at all those people hitting that like button boop, 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 boop. so go ahead and hit that like button with them i want to thank everyone for being here before we go on our inaugural test of this beast let's go ahead and take a look at her then as she's on the uh, on the test track look at that absolutely beautiful nice to get a 360 shot of this thing all right folks we're about ready to go here i think so wait what was that camera Ooh, oh it's a is it a free roll oh it's a no oh oh careful now let's listen to the let's listen to the car Ooh 
I like that. Well, you want me to do a burnout? Okay. Well, we're about ready to go. And uh, before we do, folks, just a word from our sponsors. Check this out. You guys are going to love it. I guarantee it. Watch. Check this out. Check it out. New from Rat Pack Farms, it's, of course, the Dino Diner t-shirt. Available now in our store for any construction worker or fan of our Dino Diner series. Available in both sweatshirts and, of course, for you construction workers and anybody else. Yes, mugs and tote bags. All right. So if you want to get yours, go ahead and check it out again. Dino Diner coming soon, folks. Get it before it opens here at teespring.com forward slash the Dino Diner. All right. Time for the episode. All right. Let's get to it then, folks. You guys ready? I'm ready. Let's go. Okay, let's go, let's go. No one cares? Actually, uh, I think actually uh, 25 people actually do care, and uh, they uh, purchased uh, a lot of those shirts. So thanks, everyone, for your support, all those big people, big purchases. Thank you for that, folks. If you're interested in that, go ahead and click that link. There's a lot of great T-shirts. Are we ready? Three, two, one. Here we go. Woo! All right. Third person. That might be a little easier to drive in. I can't actually see. Whoa, holy crap. The uh, top end of the pickup gets in the way. All right, now we're not. This ain't a race car or anything like that, so we don't want to. We definitely don't want to, you know, do that. Go into the wall. Let's go into first person. That might be a little easier. There we go. All right, around the solemn we go. Ooh, this is that. Ooh, this handles a lot better than any of our other cars. She's a lot slower, but definitely good. It's definitely not meant for the speed, but definitely taking the lead, baby. Yeah, everyone. Thanks, everyone. Greatly appreciated that. Sound of America, right here. Yep, sure is. Sound of freedom. Six cylinders of liberty. And let's bring it to a stop. Very nice. <sighs> Wasn't that awesome? That's that's good. A whole, a whole rebuild here in like an hour and 45 minutes. It's very good. Uh, let's see. Let's go back to the uh, garage now. Oh, and we can take a look at all of our parts too. I hope, Hopefully we have everything at 100%. This is your first live stream? Well, good. Welcome aboard. All right, everything is at 100%. Now, if we were to sell this truck now, how much would the market value of this absolutely beautiful vehicle be? Let's just go. Look, we're just curious. What, what's the value of it? Wow, 48895 plus a restoration bonus of $15,000, bringing the grand total up to somewhere around, uh, what, like 55000 Base team, thanks for subscribing. That is fantastic. All right, look at look again. Look at this thing. Just oh, oh great job! It, it was a wonderful vehicle, and congratulations, Texas. You have won here tonight. Very good. All right, folks. If you haven't already, now is a great time to hit that subscribe button. But that is it for tonight's episode, folks. That's all. That's all I got in me. I know I ran out of fuel. So thanks everyone for your super chats, waffle and uh, cool catcher. We are going to be doing a Shelby. We're going to be doing some luxury vehicles. I don't know what we're doing next. Maybe Smokey and the Bandit going on here. I don't know. Maybe some superchargers. We'll see. So anyway, that is it for tonight's episode. Thanks for tuning in, folks. You all have yourselves a, a fantastic evening. I will see you again. I don't know. Maybe tomorrow. Maybe Friday. I'm not sure. But anyway, I don't know what I'm playing next. I don't know when I'm playing it next. So make sure you're always subscribed here. You guys take care. Thanks for all of your help tonight in the tires and the uh, license plates and <laughs> the starter and everything else. You guys are fantastic. I appreciate everyone's help. I appreciate your viewership. I appreciate your friends, uh, your friendship, and, and I'm glad we're friends. So, again, come on to the TeamSpeak. Come join me. Come say hi. The last link in the description. You guys can all come and say hi to me and hang out. I mean it. I mean it. You guys always want to hang out with YouTubers? Well, come hang out with one. I want to I wanna say hi to you, except I'm actually going to go eat a snack for now. Ryan, thanks for subscribing. Take care, everyone. That's it. That's my time. So say goodbye, and I will say goodbye to you. So goodbye to RC Bro, Cowboys, Asaya. Goodbye to a Gaming Farmer and Jordan and uh, Stan, Tooth Tooth, and uh, Mason, and Wyatt, and Wolf, and Brady, and Jackson, Jordan, uh, Ray Ray, everybody else, you have yourselves a good evening. Goodbye to all of you. And uh, if, I didn't get to, if I didn't give you a shout out or if I didn't say goodbye to you, regardless, goodbye. High five. Thanks for being a friend. Uh, Crazy Dinosaur Man out. Have a good one. Bye bye. Oh, wait, the techno music stopped. <coughs>